Hi. Don't do it. Who yelled that? Wait, I can see your chat message. I can see your name next to it. You yelled that. Don't say that to me again. All right. That grip and rip was a bit lackluster. Dude, not every one. How dare you make my can of like fucking cold brew feel bad like that. Get a fucking life, you, you jerk. How could you say that to them? They are just like every other can. And that's, that's all right. That's toxic. You're toxic. You know what they say about that, chat. You gotta cut toxicity out of your life. Starts rolling out medieval catapult. We gotta get toxicity out, out of here. Loads you onto the catapult. We gotta get you out of here. And then I launch you out of the catapult. Hell out of here. That was definitely a crime. Oh yeah, there's definitely some like, like endangerment for sure. There's definitely, there's definitely some kind of endangerment there for sure, for sure. That actually happened in the news. Some students got hurt, I think, from launching themselves out of a catapult, frankly. And this might sound a little, little fucked up. They should have, someone should have gotten hurt if they decided to launch themselves out of a catapult. <laughs> if they didn't get punished in some way, then they would have continued to do it. And that would have been pretty crazy. I don't want to say good, but lessons need to be learned. I hope no one dies. <laughs> New Twitch gone ride. Yeah, guys, actually, legit though, legit though, kind of rad if they did that. What if they just doubled down on the maiming and just made people sign like full on, like I'm prepared to go out on this one, you know, kind of, kind of rides, you know, why not? Why not just double down, double down. Fucking get out there. <laughs> TwitchCon launched the euthanasia coaster. Come on, let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. I wanna see the 18 circles of ever increasing fucking G's, dude. I wanna see it. Oh yeah, we're gonna play Zed Zone today. It's like Cataclysm and Zomboid. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. I have not played a ton of it, because frankly, I didn't want to spoil it for myself, but it's been... It's pretty cool. What happens if you survive the euthanasia coaster? I think that confirms that you are officially unkillable. I think that's what that means. Well, at the end, they just have a person with a gun. So, like, if you get to the end of the ride, <laughs> if you get to the end of the ride and you're still alive, they, they just fucking wrap it up really quick. Yeah, they have the backup. Yeah, that's the thing is that the coaster just stops at a brick wall. That's, like, the really crazy part. They just, they don't tell you that at the end of the coaster, even if you live, they slam you right into a brick wall as hard as they can. So, like, no matter what, you're pretty much not getting out of there. Painted tunnel ending, basically. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh... Oh, 
boy, I really need the coffee, dude. Holy crap. I need the coffee today, man. I was up so late last night trying to futilely attempt to get uh, both of those mods for Bloodborne to work. <laughs> uh, attempting futilely uh, because it just won't, it just won't work. Uh, I can't get both of them to work. We're probably just going to do the randomizer without 60 FPS because we'd be... If it was 60 FPS 1080, I'd care more, but because it's 60 FPS 720 and that's as high as it can possibly go before the game just can't handle it anymore, I'm probably just going to settle on playing the game at the normal FPS that no one can complain about because we all know you most likely played the game at that FPS and have seen almost every format of video in that as well. I'm finally glad we have this emote. Yeah, the last, it was, dude, I for, I put together Bloodborne last night like six times. <laughs> it took about six hours. It takes about an hour to fully extract and set up with these mods in like five different ways and like combinations and not one of them, not one of them stuck with everything because sometimes you'd set it up it would be working fine with like 60 FPS. You extract it. And when you extract it for some reason, it deletes the uh, the hotfix. Or like you, you put it all back together. There's like a specific order you have to do it all. And then it still just might not even work when you punch it out on the other side. So it's like at a certain point, what's the fucking point? What, what is the point, <laughs> you know? So we're just not gonna. We're just not gonna. It's a stream with Twitch's bitrate. You wouldn't be able to tell if there's extra frames or not. Yeah, I know. Dude, I love modern games. You guys have you guys are talking like you could possibly ex like understand the the life I've lived in the last two days. You you can't. I'm sorry. I appreciate you like coming out here with me, but I'm out here. I'm out here with a fucking console and a like USB stick. <laughs> I'm using URL website pages on my PS4 that launch code <laughs> when you click on them, and that's how you do it. All right, we are not the same right now. I'm sorry. It's not been, it wouldn't be so bad if like the, if like the mods could be placed on a fully prepared version of this game, but instead you have to fucking take the whole thing apart. And you know, obviously I'm also out here being like, if I, this does work, I better have a backup before I fuck with it. So I'm like making backups and every one of those backups takes about for 30 minutes to make, like copying and pasting these files from one folder to another for backups takes about 30 minutes because they're completely uncompressed. So there's like 50 or 60,000 unique things in these folders. It's unhinged. It's not, it ain't right. Me working on my server's Minecraft server. Lol cry. Bro. Bro, I remember I remember back when I used to when I used to set up Minecraft servers. I remember back when I used to set up Minecraft. Not anymore. I don't do that no more. I can't live like you. Down bad at modding. You don't need to add the down one. You could just say bad at modding. You fucking, oh, oh.
No, I don't think I will. Fuck you! Dude! And... I just want peace. You know, I just want peace. I just want, I just want a moment of peace without all of the chaos. Just one, just one moment. Chat toxicity at 136%. I would put chat toxicity at like 40% most of the time. There's a lot of toxic. There's a lot of toxic messages out here. All right. That's not so bad. I'm trying to be I'm trying to be generally like I'm trying to be a little generous here and nice cuz I don't I want to be realistic, you know. I'm about to raise it. That has sinister implications. And mods, let's just let's just nip that in the bud right now, yeah. Let's just get that out of here now. Thanks. Isn't it nice to have a mod who deletes mean messages? Yeah, I mean that's epic. That's epic. You thanked your fake mods a lot yesterday, just saying something think about, yeah, I was RPing like a, like a good, well, no, a, 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 yeah, a good streamer, I guess. I was RPing that day. Did you not notice the voice? It was RP. There was, there, that's why there was a voice. Can't we RP all the time? Uh, no. I'm tired. I'm tired. I just want to play a video game. No, I think maybe another time. I'm <laughs> tired. Ends the stream. Yeah, chat, I think, honestly, I really do want to normalize ending my streams as well as my RP persona in Streamer Life Simulator ends their streams, you know? We could really strive to be more like Grup in that regard and just kind of, like, stop streaming because I feel like any moment could be my last and, like, just, like, in mid-sentence just cut off and disappear. Like, I, I don't want to say, yeah, like, I don't want to say my role model is Grup and always has been Grup, but it might be Grup. You know? I just want to end more of my streams by accidentally ripping my monitors out of the walls. You know, just like really rip them off of the desk and throw them somewhere. Turn the webcam on? No. No, I don't. Guys, I just don't have the fucking energy to sit here. Look, you missed the window where I would have been able to comfortably do webcam streams like a long time ago, right? It would have been during the winter when it was cool in my house for once. Now it's getting hot again. And that means I'm getting fucking sweaty. All right, you don't want to see how nasty all this gestures to himself can get. All right, this bad boy can output a lot of fucking nasty sweat just all the time. I can't. You know how carefully I have to climate control this room before I have to go on D&D for like webcam stuff? Carefully, all right? Every Sunday when I would wake up 
for like sessions of D&D &D in the summer, it would be like a two hour prep of like, I have to get the ACI and blast it. I, it has to be blasted. I have to seal every other entrance that could be like letting out the cold air. Like it has to be, cause I'm gonna, I only have like an, I, I have to have the air, like the AC off during the session or everyone's gonna be hearing my AC the whole time. I fight for my life. Which is weird because I don't sweat a lot when I work out. And I know I'm push, I, I run a lot now. I've been doing a lot of cardio. I'm entering another in shape arc, Chet. I, I'm entering, my elbows have stopped being horribly wounded and my tingling one has remained stagnant at only a little bad. And I'm seeing like an orthopedic like professional for like further help with that. So I've been re-entering my workout arc gently. I'm I'm getting back into shape again. I run like a mile or two every evening. Feels good, man. I don't think I'll ever be in as good of a cardio shape as I was in, uh, like when I was like way younger though, like 10 years ago. <laughs> I, I don't think I'll ever be back to that. I'm quite happy like running like two or like one or two miles at like, you know, nine minutes or 10 minutes each and just calling it at that for a while. <laughs> I have no desire to speed it up. I don't need to. old man tomato. It feels good to get back in shape. I, I felt, I would say the most like genuinely bummed I've been in the last like eight months. A lot of that has been due to the fact that I couldn't really work out. Like it's not about, it, it, was, it wasn't about like getting bulked or anything. It just makes me feel good to work out. It makes me feel like I'm not so disgusting. <laughs> if that makes sense. So I just, I just like doing it. Like I've not, I've not run a single time in the last like two weeks where I've been like, oh fuck, I don't want to do this. It's been like, oh no, I want to do this right now. I want to. Did you get a, I, I, did you get a tonal workout like the other streamers? I don't know what you're talking about. Huh? Like all other streamers, you know? Like the others. Not enough space for home workouts. I'm pretty lucky. Yeah, I've got like a whole home gym situation, including like a treadmill. So I just, although I'm bummed. I can't, I still don't want to use my, I have, I bought a rowing machine like a while back and I preferred using that over using a treadmill. But um, I'm worried to do that one with my elbow. Still, I, I, I like actually don't think I should do that one with my elbow, how it is. Cause I feel like if I'm gonna fuck it up somehow, it's gonna be doing a full like repeating motion on that elbow while I row for like 30 minutes. But the second I get the go ahead, dude, I'm back on that machine. I got a rowing machine, it kills me after like 50 minutes. It's such a good workout. It's such a good workout, dude. I loved the rowing machine, holy heck. How are your old man knees? Not doing bad, actually. I've been, honestly, I talk a lot of shit about my knees but like they've not been giving me any trouble when I've been running. And that's like usually the point where they'd be giving me trouble. So I think I was just, I think they were just wildly out of shape a couple months ago. Cause I haven't, I hadn't been using them. It turns out if you don't use parts of your body, they hurt really bad when you use them. So that's cool. That's a wild thing to find out.
Why are all my favorite streamers fucking dying? I thought I just established I'm doing pretty good. Matter of fact, like, dude, I've been doing, re I would say I've been doing very good, which means I'm setting myself up for a real nasty fall. You know what I mean? But I've been feeling good. I've been feeling good. Which means I'm gonna die in a couple of moments. I can only assume. He's gonna break a bone soon? I've never broken a bone. And people can say it's me jinxing myself when I say this, but I, like, it's gonna be hard for me to break, like, the bones most people break. Like, I, I did a lot of, I did a lot of sports with my legs and a lot of practicing falling when I was doing martial arts a lot to the point where most of the time when you break a bone in a way that I would with my lifestyle uh I would it would be because I fell and put my arm out stupidly to catch me at like full extension or some shit and that I just don't do that because like it's not my it's not second nature for me to try to stop my if anything i'm gonna break something in vr yeah actually for, that's real if i'm gonna break like part of one of my arms or like hands it's gonna be vr i'd have to be in vr i'd have to be like skiing like it would it would have to be skiing or like vr it'd be some it would have to be something that's like not that i'm not used to or like i literally fell down the stairs <laughs> i think I've like gotten close to breaking my pinkies many times though, including recently. I slammed my pinky into something really hard when I tripped going up the stairs. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm constantly, my pinkies constantly under attack. Tripping on stairs feels like you're about to die. Oh yeah. I trip up, I, I trip going up the stairs all the time. I never trip going down the stairs. You wanna know why I always trip going up the stairs? Cause I'm, <laughs> cause I, over the course of being like a tall lad, I like when I was younger would just skip a step. Like I would always go two steps at a time. I always skip one. Cause I'm like, I just wanna go up faster. And sometimes, you just, when you do that every like maybe two years or three years, you don't do it right and you fucking, you, you pay the fucking price, man. But it is more efficient. I do two by two every time. Question marks? You're question marking <laughs> and I can only assume that's because you, uh, you aren't uh, tall enough to do it. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, partner. <laughs> Uh, sorry, partner. <laughs> Maybe next time. Oof. <laughs> there were some times where I'd push it up to three steps at a time, dude, like a sicko. But that's when you're entering, like, the true danger zone. I couldn't do that. I couldn't do that anymore. Small is better than tall. That's <laughs> the craziest cope. The thing is, it doesn't really matter how tall or small you are. You are as long as you don't enter the range of too small or too tall, where things stop being convenient for you. I, I stand by that. Where you can be too tall and you are turning corners in houses and slamming your head on like, you know, door frames and shit. Gmart height? Gmart's a big guy. Yeah. Gmart's very tall. I think he's the tallest guy I know. I, I don't know though. I don't think I've seen... He He's taller than Sam. I think. He's taller than Sam.
Thanks, Lore Master. <laughs> Thanks, Lore Master, for knowing the like assu like almost having their exact heights, you know, down. Wow, what do you fucking mean? I'm not doing this. <laughs> they they all caps wowed me for thanking them for knowing that. And I assume it wasn't going to be followed with a wow, thanks for acknowledging me. Yeah, exactly. See what I mean? See what I mean? <laughs> Dude, I'm running out of coffee. I'm running out of coffee, Chad. It's getting bad. You know what that means? I'm gonna have to get more. <laughs> that sucks. Grip and rip take two. I never grip and rip two cans of cold brew on stream. That would kill me. Chat, it's like three cups of coffee in one of these cans. It lasts me, the caffeine from this lasts me all stream. And when I start feeling my energy wane in about four and a half to five hours, I'm like, it, it's my cue to fuck off because the caffeine's gone. Do you not drink a whole pot to yourself? I don't drink a, it might seem like I drink a lot of coffee, <clears throat> but I've also been toning that down in my life because I find myself more energetic all the time than I used to be. I only really drink the cold brew in the morning during, well, actually, no, it depends on how early I wake up. If I wake up like early, I'll drink like a double shot of espresso or like a shot of espresso. And then I'll have the cold brew can if I'm streaming. But other than that, I don't have any coffee. Which is still like, compared to most people, probably a lot of coffee. Uh, but for me, is quite a bit less coffee than I used to drink. <laughs> How's your heart rate during the day? All of my heart stuff is literally fine to the point where I just had an ultrasound of my full heart and cardiovascular system taken like two months ago. All right, I, I, my heart is doing great apparently. It's never been better. Sneers the Otter, thanks for the 10 tier 3 subs. They did the old misclick classic chat. They did the old misclick classic. They whiffed it. Thanks for the tier three subs. Never a misclick for you, brother. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, that's awfully kind of you. Thank you. Damn, damn. If you got a tier three sub, get excited. You receive absolutely nothing over a tier two sub. Badass. That's badass. You can now afford coffee. Yeah, all I gotta do, the problem is I just, you guys know I get my cold brew coffees from Costco. All right, I'm a, I'm a Kirkland man. All right, I, I got, I got brand loyalty to Kirkland. Although sometimes I do wonder about that because last I checked their cold brews got recalled for some reason. <laughs> But I didn't look that up, and there, therefore I don't have to care. Uh, but I do know <laughs> that I still, I still drink it. All right, I still drink it. Off-brand Andy, I feel bad for you. <laughs> I feel a genuine pity for you. I feel bad for you saying that about Kirkland. How, how do you off-brand? You said. Damn. They don't know. Well, you may never know. K 
Kirkland is Kirkland is the brand. Exactly, exactly. Recalled in 2023 due to foreign metal substance in the cans. In the liquid or in the cans? <laughs> Cause the cans are metal. <laughs> Full of lead. Ah, uh, yes. Guys, I got so much microplastic in me. Guys, you got no idea how much microplastic I've been loading up. Microplastics, leads, all of it. Hell yeah. The human body is at least 70% microplastics after all. Yeah. And that's like cool. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah, I, that was a dark time when they recalled all that stuff. I mean, to be honest though, whatever they recalled, I probably drank it. <laughs> like, like being realistic, Based off the timing, I probably did down a lot of lead and I lived and I'm feeling better for it. So maybe they're the problem. But I mean, hey, here's to here's to hoping there's no more uh there's no more solid blocks of just steel inside of my coffee. It's why your elbows are all fucked. One, my elbows were just fucked up because I worked out. I did, I actually did too many push-ups. Uh, I did too many. I pushed myself far too far. And every one of my muscles in my arms paid the price when I slept without icing them. But my, my left side, so five. <sighs> I have nothing to prove to you guys. So yeah, it was five with 600 pounds of weights on me, all right? 600 pounds of weight strapped to my body. And I was like, I w when I was like working out hard like eight months ago, I would do like a hundy pushups. <laughs> most, most days if I was doing like chest workout. Uh, I did 80 <laughs> the day of the mistake. I did 80. Uh, not all at once. I did them in like, I did them in like three reps or like four reps or something. Cause I was like, I'm going to take it easy. And I felt fine until after. Yeah, I did them in sets and I fucked up. <laughs> yeah. It was a few too many. I should have, sh I didn't, but the problem was I didn't feel like I was having a problem. Like I was struggling as much as anyone would struggle when they're like pushing, like, you know, muscle. And then, and then I felt bad when I woke up the next day. Like I felt fine going to sleep and everything. So I didn't even know I needed to like ice or like do anything. And then my arms were all swollen up <laughs> in a bad way that didn't make me look muscular. It made me look like I was dying. <laughs> Yeah, that was, that for like a week, they didn't heal. It was actually crazy. Like, I don't think if I, like, it actually stayed really bad, like really bad for like five, six days. And I was like, I must have fucked up a tendon. Like, I was genuinely like, I fucked up a tendon or something. Like, I both of my arms, I fucked up the tendons and they're not getting better because of it. So I like, had to like call my primary care. And to literally get on the phone and be like, I worked out too hard. I did too many push-ups and now I can't bend my huge muscles. <laughs> and they were like, we're going to call you back. And they like made it sound so urgent. And I was like, okay, I'm just going to put on ice on my arms. I like bought like these fancy ice wraps that you could put like right on your arms. And I just rotated them on and off like every like three hours. And then like, a day or two later, everything was fine. 
Like, <laughs> I, it's like a miracle, dude. I was so worried for like three days straight that I had like actually fucked up my arms really bad. Is does Icy Hot actually do anything, dude? Icy Hot's a fucking scam. I, I like, truly, uh, I fucking hate it. Skip Icy Hot. Get yourself like a good, like actual ice wrap, like some good ones, and then get something that you can use for heat as well, and like rotate those. That way better than like doing that fucking like chemical shit. Just like actually get the products that do the job without a bunch of like weird goo. It's a numbing agent. Yeah, I mean, the thing that I think helped the most was that I also, like, three days in, clocked how bad my swelling was on both of my arms, and I just started downing ibuprofen, <laughs> which I've been, in the past, very hesitant to do for pain because it raises your blood pressure. But uh, I needed it. <laughs> I, I needed it. It wasn't a choice anymore because it helped with the swelling. It was anti-inflammatory. It wasn't like about the pain. It was that I needed something to like get rid of how bad the swelling was on my arms. It taught me a valuable lesson. I learned a valuable lesson a week and a half ago or like two weeks ago. Because I've never had that problem in my life before, like that bad. Like where you push it that bad. Oh, I just wanted to immediately go back to where I was, you know, six or eight months ago. Is that so wrong? Is it so wrong to want to skip all of the building back up to where you used to work out? Is that so wrong? Why can I not just get on the treadmill and run like a six minute mile? What's, and what's so wrong with that? What's so wrong? Why can't I get on my treadmill and run a six minute mile again? It's bullshit. Rocky does it. <laughs> Rocky did it. Rocky was doing that kind of shit all the time. Poopathon. Get that shit out of my chat. I'm not grump. Serious question, how you talk so much without getting a sore throat? I don't go for eight hours a day. There's a chat, like, to be clear, um, there's a reason I don't do long streams beyond just not, like, wanting to have, like, beyond just wanting to have other, like, time to do stuff with my night. Uh, it's because if I go much longer than four or five hours, my voice will get worn out. And finding this, like, rhythm that I've been in for the last, like, year, my voice really never gets pushed that bad even when I get stupid and like silly with it and do like funny voices for a stream it's never really pushed so bad that I'm not good the next day if I need to be but like you could see how fast like when I did Metal Gear Rising Revengeance how fast my voice deteriorates I've really got about five or six hours with my voice before I need to give it a break when I'm like going at the energy I usually do for streams I just don't have it. I don't have it like other people have it. Eternally crusty vocal cords. Do you do vocal exercises? No, but I do have like, I do have like vocal sprays and stuff that I use on my throat if I've pushed it really hard that do help. I've got like, I've got some nasty concoctions in my like cabinets. I've got some strange potions I ordered online that do help. I would describe them as potions, actually. <laughs> They're not. I would never be like, this is medicine. I'd be like, this is a fucking potion. Like a an elixir. That I could have just as easily purchased off the side of the road from a snake oil salesman back in the early 1900s. But it works. It works. 
It probably helps. Well, I mean, it helps the same way that drinking like green tea with like honey helps. Like, <laughs> you know, it's like the throat. It's not like I'm fucking eating glass. It just needs like it just needs like moisture and like, you know, basic, extremely basic stuff to really fix it up. Tell us the secret formula. I think I just told you and you missed it. <laughs> I think I did tell you and you just didn't catch it. Open the whiskey. Yeah, I use medicine. Yeah, what can I say? I know a couple of, I know a couple of fixes. Nothing wrong with a little drink. Yep. I heard smoking cigars helps with a sore throat. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh. yeah. Oh. Smoking is not cool, dude. Smoking is not cool, but drinking is epic. <laughs> that's what, that's, that's what I've learned, dude. If you're of legal drinking age, though, dude, because that's pog. I feel like, though, if you say the word pog, you should immediately, like, have, like, immediately any, like, drinks you own should be taken away from you. You know what I mean? Like, if that's the kind of language you're walking around using in real life, you should have that shit taken away. Immediately. What if it's ironic? Like how I use it, ironically? Uh, no, I feel like any, I feel like saying it ironically is also you in a way saying it unironically. I mean, it's a fun word to say. It always starts out ironic and then you become the monster you hated so much. One day I'll use the word pog unironically and I'll just start screaming and then I'll die. Yeah, sure. Ironically, heard that before. Yeah. Will you stream that? Dude. I can't believe no one's found my secret second stream channel where I just leave my stream on 24-7 off of this one. I turn it on the second that this one ends every day. You've just not seen it. Of course it'll be streamed. On the secret channel. Don't worry, I watch Grup 2. <laughs> yeah, on my on my alt channel, Grup. <laughs> yeah. The one with the webcam just pointing towards a rancid burrito behind my desk. That's real, man. Chat, be honest, would you watch Grup for real? Would you, chat? Would you watch Grup? Be honest. The amount of people that are saying yes are actually delusional or not being honest with themselves is the thing because Grup was unwatchable. Grup was someone that would have one viewer and it, it, would, it would actually be someone there by accident that doesn't know how Twitch works. There, no one's watching Grup. Maybe people would have watched Grup during the Poopathon, but that would have been like a hate watch. It wouldn't have been like watching them because they thought it was fun. D 
Dude. <laughs> oh, man. What the fuck is he talking about? Well, I invented a new version of a subathon called a poopathon, where you hold it until the timer <laughs> ends. <laughs> it's, it's, it's kind of the most dystopian approach <laughs> to a subathon I could possibly design. <laughs> It's, it's just bad. It's a bad one, isn't it? What's wrong with you? Dude, there's nothing wrong with me. What's wrong with Grup? I am not Grup. I'm not Grup, dude. That person on the monitor was not me. All right? We leave that shit behind us. I mean, subathons are already pretty dystopian. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they make a lot of money, but, um, I couldn't do it. I couldn't. Absolutely fucking not in a million years. The only way that I could do any kind of, like, marathon-style stream is with a very clear, like, this is as long as it's ever going to be, like, bar made long beforehand but like that's not people don't want to see that people want to people don't want a cap cap a, a cap is gonna immediately make someone care less like there can't be a cap right that's like kind of how it works is the problem so like you know it's just dystopian <laughs> it's it's fucked up you don't tell them that there's a cap well, my cap would be secretly just pretend, like, actually fabricating a tech issue that's unsalvageable, you know? Or my cap would be a fabricated bit I pre-planned, like, months in advance that would end the subathon no matter what at a certain point. That was, like, scripted or something. You'd have to do that. That's the only way I could do it. But I never would. Like, to be clear, I'm spitballing bullshit that'll never happen. Because I have zero desire. To do that. You grab your monitor and shut your whole stream set off off like grub. Basically, I'd have to do a grub. <laughs> Essentially, on day six of the subathon, I stand in the corner of the camera for about five minutes while people just monk a W, and then I walk up to it, I grab the fucking like monitor and rip it off the wall and just like you know and that's it i grab it people start screaming rip it off the wall and then uh that's the end of the whole thing i don't post any updates on discord or anything for about a week and i come back as if nothing happened Yeah, that'd probably be how you'd have to do it, but like, absolutely not, never. Just end it like Blair Witch. Man. I want to do a ghost hunting stream one day. Like a real one. I know Bruce did one. Someday I want to do that. The amount of stuff that I would do. Like there is a genuine. Like Dave and I have talked about a lot of stupid ideas we have. But so much of it comes down to location. And unfortunately the location I'm in. Has, has never really had the options that I want to do like cool concepts and shit <clears throat> and it just never will so it's like unfortunately a lot of a lot of my like stuff I, I we we've talked about funny stupid shit we want to do but like all of its things that like just can't happen until i've moved unfortunately oh no 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 the, uh, massachusetts is haunted as fuck you can't turn a corner without something being haunted but like at the end of the day a lot of my cool ideas i want to do with friends like with Dave, 
and stuff. So it's like the location uh, of being where I am doesn't really cut it, you know? The kitchen goblin. Yeah. He's moving to the UK? Absolutely not. <laughs> well, no, no, no. Nor would I ever likely move to Austin. Ever. If I was going to move somewhere, it'd be a city I actually liked. <laughs> it would have to be somewhere I liked. Uh, so, uh, never LA. Maybe Seattle. I like Seattle. It would have to be a t it would have to be a city I've gone to and actually liked when I was there. For re like, yeah, like I'm not gonna go to fucking I'm not gonna go to L.A. That place was an actual cesspool. Those property values, though. Everywhere you go, there's some problem with the place. Okay but at least I can pick a place where I have no actual genuine problems with like navigating it and looking at it. <laughs> you know, at least I can do that for myself, right? Like I, I can do that for myself. Canada, why the fuck would I go to Canada? Chat, why would I go there? Why pray tell would I do that? Why would I do that to myself? For the challenge. <laughs> dude, I'm doing a real life challenge run, dude. Dude, aren't I already on the challenge run then? <laughs> Do you know how high the income tax is where I live? I'm already on the challenge run. Do you know how hard the government fucks me? <laughs> you think I'm not on the challenge run? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, right. It's hard. All right, that's the answer. It's hard. Whenever some streamer moves to fucking like Texas or some shit, or like Florida, they're activating easy mode. All right, they're taking the easy mode. That's what's happening. They're moving to a place with no income tax. They're going to easy mode. Easy mode, dude. Couldn't handle the difficulty. Couldn't handle financial destitution. Couldn't handle getting earned. <laughs> couldn't, couldn't handle, couldn't handle it. Couldn't handle seeing the bill? Dude, every day I think about moving to a place with less income tax. Every day I I look I I I look around. Oh boy. To be in easy mode. Financially. Why the fuck? No, dude. No, 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 no. A lot of people talk about Florida. I don't know how anyone could go there ever in their entire life. That's all I'm saying. I, I only went to Florida one time when I was a wee lad for Disney World. It was cool for that. But uh, that's just about all the Florida I could handle even as a child. That place is a... F I, I, I just couldn't do that. I couldn't do, <laughs> I couldn't do that. I couldn't. I couldn't. Massachusetts isn't bad. Like, it, I, I've never had any real complaints, like, looking around Massachusetts, functioning in Massachusetts, where I'm like, Massachusetts fucking sucks. 
Uh, the only thing that really fucks me with Massachusetts is income tax, dude. I get owned. I get owned. I get owned. That's, that's the problem out here. I get owned. Wyoming opinions. Huh? What? Wyoming? You gonna ask me about South Dakota next or some shit? Yeah, none. People aren't out- people- <laughs> There's like six people out there, dude. I don't have time for that. I just don't want to go there. Wyoming is real. It's out there, dude. It's real. People go there. Billionaires. The billionaires are kicking the millionaires out of Wyoming. Is there some shadow war between, like, the, like, upper class going on in Wyoming that I've been unaware of? Is there a shadow war going on? <laughs> what are you talking about? Has been for years. Hashtag all eyes on Wyoming. What are you? They can have it. Let's just send all the billionaires and millionaires to fucking Wyoming and like fence them in. Like a zoo. They can have it. Take Wyoming. Wyoming Billionaire Fortnite, all caps. Dude, that's, that's. Wyoming, ha dude, what is, no, but for real, what's the deal with Wyoming? Why were, is there actually like a, is there actually something going on in Wyoming that billionaires are fascinated with? It's Wyoming. It's a cheap Colorado with our nuke silos in it. You're kidding? One guy stopped talking about Wyoming. Do you think that this whole thing is just someone from Wyoming really desperate for anyone to talk about it? So they fabricated an entire Wyoming storyline so that I would just go into detail about it and give them some sick dopamine? <laughs> They, someone from fucking South Dakota is like, have you heard about the South Dakota upper class battle? The battle royale that's constantly going on? So just so I would talk about it, that, that, that's not real? There's no battle royale in South Dakota? The snake wars? <laughs> I got, I actually got hacked. Whatever, man. Who cares? We're gonna get into the game once I get back uh, back from the bathroom, all right? I'll be right back.
What happened to peepees? <laughs> Wait, why, why is everyone so upset? What happened to peepees? Removed from BTTV. Yeah, but that's the thing, though, is that there is no such thing as moderating a, like, emote, you know, platform like that. Which means if I go to emotes and I search... P. 50 bucks, I see a replacement in about half a second. Like, if I start looking it up... You can't just delete things. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> We're moving on. Edit, don't care. No, nah, it's... Chat, it's not what you think it is. This is some urge shit. Right here. Show it. You're not gonna like it. Alright. Added it. I added it at the pee pee dance. You happy? You wanted me to add it before you really knew what you were asking for. Get rid of it. <laughs> no, 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 no. You asked for it. Now you get what you asked for. Now you get what you deserve. You asked for PP pee -pee dance, you get PP pee -pee dance. You're gonna be, you're gonna be getting, you're gonna be getting that, all right? That's what you get. You're welcome, by the way. <laughs> by the way, you're welcome. Many a streamer would refuse to add such an emote. But not me. All right. Curse this piss themed monkey's paw. Ain't that the way, man? Ain't that the way? <laughs> he might as well add drink pee pees. Katie, what the fuck are you talking about? About to take away the mop. About to, about to take away the mop. About to take it away. <laughs> we can, we can all agree that PP's PP dance is one of the worst emotes I've ever added. Right? Like this, this thing is bad. Like, can we all agree that it's bad, bad? It's the worst. But you know what it reminds me of, chat? It reminds me of the pizza from fucking Hypnospace Outlaw. It reminds me of the pizza. It's the pizza. Pa 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 pizza, pizza. You know, it's that guy. <laughs> Come on. All right. Well, we're getting into the game now. We're getting into the video game. So this is Zed Zone Apocalypse Ahead. It is, uh, I think, a, I think it's a originally Korean game that's been translated. Like it's, it, uh, it's from a Korean dev. Uh, so there might be some translation problems here or there. But I haven't seen that many. Chinese, according to Steam. Then that's likely what it is. Lobotomy. I just think of Lobotomy Corporation. I just think of that and I and like I think about how bad it could have been back in the day and how bad it was. But yeah. So that's all. 
so far, what I've played, pretty good. Uh, so, I and that's not been much. It's not been much. I've not given it that much of a much of time because I didn't really want to spoil a bunch for myself. But uh, should, I'm, I'm I'm looking forward to it. Performance-wise, it's still bad. I don't have as many performance issues as many people have with any game, so take that all with a grain of salt. Uh, I don't really have many, many opportunities to comment on performance in games. Uh, that's the side effect of dumping a lot of money onto a PC because it's my job. All right, so I'm going to delete the game data of this character, but I'm probably going to use a character that I've already pre-made because there's not a lot of interesting stuff for the character creator right now at all. And uh, I can kind of show you what I've picked here instead and save us like 20 minutes of going through a really just annoying fucking character wall. It's a little cumbersome. But yeah, this is the character I put together. It's the UI does not work very well so far. Uh, but yeah, ugly. <laughs> I wanted to make a character that uses guns because the guns in this game work really well. I didn't want to do a melee character this time. Di game difficulty, easy. I haven't picked it yet. Gonna go up to 100%, I just haven't picked it yet. I'm gonna do normal, we're gonna do everything normal. I'm gonna make a new map. ADHD is a really bad debuff, I speak from experience. Pretty sure I have ADHD. <laughs> I, mo everyone in my family has now been diagnosed with some form of ADD or ADHD. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we're gonna do normal, medium, everything. We're just gonna follow what the game says for the map settings. I want to get into the game as quickly as possible for this one, to be honest. But uh, yeah, we're gonna do shotgun only for the gun reserve setting, which means hunting guns can be found in some civilian homes. Gun shops have weapons for sale, mainly shotguns and bolt action rifles. If you want to find a full auto weapon, you have to go to police station, military camp, or another facility. So the way that it's kind of set up, gun of I like the setting for gun availability a lot. I think it's a pretty interesting way to do it, where you can like set it to be like a total ban. So the only way you're gonna find weapons for like guns is at like a police station or a military outpost. I think shotgun. I think shotgun only is a pretty cool one. Uh, town density normal, vegetation density, whatever's default. Uh, map name. Uh, we're just gonna. It doesn't fucking matter. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna call it. Um, Huh? Cool. Map setting made. My guy's gonna be good at using guns. All right, I wanna be good at using guns. There's not many trait options in the game as it is, but he's gonna be good at using guns. He's gonna have fragile burns. He's gonna be prone to panic. <laughs> Ugly, which is my instant lock for CDDA, so I just grabbed it as soon as I saw it. I don't know if it matters more for this game, but I see the game give me the option to pick Ugly on site because it's free all right uh yep adhd i don't actually remember why that one's uh what that one does for this but i'm pretty sure it'll tell me when i go into the thing uh animal induction that means animals like me that means animals like me uh cold-blooded that just means that i don't feel bad when i when i Take a life. It just means I'm not gonna feel anything at all when I take a life with these hands. Of course. Raw meat eater. It means I won't feel bad or uh, have any um, bad effects when I eat raw meat. Shotgun mastery. I just picked a gun weapon type that I liked. That seemed fun. So, good at using shotguns. And Porter's is literally, it seems like, a reference to uh, Death Stranding. 
It just makes you better at carrying things, which feels like an instant lock in a game like this. It just makes you, it just gives you like better, you know, carry weight availability. But yeah, that's them. Uh, you can technically customize your character's like looks, but it's, God, every time I've gone to the UI, something's broken for me on the character creator. I, th I don't know if it's just me or not, but I like punched out a character and just called it a day. Because <laughs> the rest of the games worked fine for me. But for some reason, like a lot of the UI elements stopped working for me with my resolution, I think, on the character creator. So I'm not going to customize them much. I am glad it lets me just grab a, uh, a preset. All right. Huh? It's gonna take us a minute to load in. But then I'll explain the game. It's very zomboid. Oh God. Select a weapon. A double barrel shotgun, a sturdy fire axe, a compound crossbow, or a baseball bat with wire on it. Double barrel shotgun. Dear gamer. <laughs> Hi. Thank you for joining the Zed Zone Apocalypse Ahead Early Access. Okay, yeah, whatever. Advices, you can craft bows and arrows, scavenge for weapons and equipment. There's a large laboratory to the east. There may be something interesting on the computer. Okay. Well, here we are. Hang on. Options, I think it reset a lot of my settings. So give me one sec before we go in because I don't I think I had the UI made a little bit larger yeah I liked it I liked it a little no hang on that wasn't the button hold up one second I just want to make sure that I didn't fuck with anything keep it normalized uh yeah we're good I think I think we're good I think we're good there's not a lot of settings Chat already bored of PP pee dance. Come on, guys. <laughs> you love PP pee dance. You love PP pee dance. Don't you love PP pee dance? Isn't, are you having a good time hanging out with PP pee dance? All right. Looks like we crashed here. Take a look here. So uh, we're gonna. So this is my full inventory space right now. I have a big water bottle. I have some C. Batteries. I have uh, 24 rounds of 12 gauge shotgun, a laser sight, a wide angle flashlight uh, with no batteries in it. So we're going to load it up with two batteries because it needs two to turn on. I'm going to get that equipped on my character. PP Dance is gone. No, PP Dance is here to stay, guys. We're going to take a crowbar off of this guy. What the hell was that sound? Oh, it was just this little rat. Come here. I think I got him. I think I got him, but the, there's a fire spreading from the uh, helicopter, so we're going to try to grab this stuff really quick. A Kevlar suit, we're going to steal that and put that on. There's a note, we'll read that later. Malfunctioning CAS computer system. I don't know what that is. Homemade cape, put that on. Some red dose mutagen. Mutation potion is only used to upgrade skills. Please do not eat it. Pharmaceutical made from the extract of special mutants. It can increase strength. The side effects are unknown. It says food on the can. <laughs> but, but game. <laughs> I'm getting mixed messages. The game says it's food. <laughs> food. Don't eat it. Inedible. Well, how am I supposed to figure that out when you say it like that? And 20, uh, 50, 25 caliber bullets. And a Ataman M2R air rifle. Well, I guess we'll equip it. I'll also get my shotgun on as well. Clear out some more inventory space. All right. That's one guy looted. Uh, other one had a Smith & Weston 929 revolver. Some more shotgun rounds. Get those moved over and some green goo and some blue goo. Some more notes. And another shotgun. Uh, what kind of shotgun is this? I'm gonna disassemble it because I have a double barrel that I got and I think that's a one round. We love goo! We love goo! 
All right. Thought you were gonna just walk on by, huh? You dinner. You dinner. Get ready, we're gonna eat you. Yep. Hell yeah, we're gonna eat that. All right, so we got a bunch of wood, we got a dead rat. It's inedible, but we're gonna, once we've, once we've got that thing nice and cooked up, chopped up, be real good. And we got, we got some notes to read though. We'll start with this one. Access QZ by helicopter. It's the operation plan. After landing, Team A guard the aircraft, fire at will. Team B go to the laboratory and lead the evacuation of Class A experts, fire at will. Rescue VIPs first, avoid combat if possible. Team members must wear masks at all times. Those who are exposed cannot board. F fire freely on the infected, including asymptomatic infected. Backup evacuation plan. There's a small backup vessel available for evacuation on the East Coast. Okay. Uh, I don't, uh, I think I'm, uh, part of the evacuation team. What's the map looking like? Oh, oh, hey. So that's gotta be the lab that they were talking about. Uh, we got some cars. How big's this map? Holy crap. Okay, well, if we wanted to leave, hang on, let me just... We have a boat, apparently, on the coast down there. That's cool. It's a little far away, though. Let's see here. Let me read the other notes I got. We got a note for note or formula. Wait a minute. I just read that. That was the operation plan. Did I just... Do I have two operation plans? Operation plan, operation plan. They're all operation plan. All right. Well, we know the operation plan. Let me take, can I go inside? Can I look look inside the helicopter? No. Well, we gotta figure out what the hell we're doing here as soon as I grab this other dead rat. Maybe we uh, take a look inside this house here. See if we can cheat mask. Effective time, five hours. Hey, why do I ha Oh no, chat. We have to actually protect ourselves from an airborne like creature or some shit shoes i have casual shoes on i grab this ammo i'm gonna take a look inside this house before we do anything else let's just get in there i open the door it uh looks like i'm not getting in that i'm gonna climb in through the window i think the door is uh jammed up well Oh, hey, a gun. That's easy. All right, we already got another firearm. Looks like we're loaded. A su another survival shotgun. We'll just dis we'll just disassemble that. Get the parts. What? My guy looks extra hairy, dude. My dude's looking nasty. I could pick lock this if I had a lock pick. I don't have one, so we're not going to be opening that. Let's just get everything we can and figure out where the hell we are. Got a bunch of lockers. All right, well, we can sleep here. Has the fire outside gone away? This door's fucked, which I guess is fine because I'd probably climb out the window anyways. This isn't spreading, right? No, this is like a, this is like a visual, this one. I know there is like real fire that can spread, but it doesn't look like that one's gonna... Can I light this? Uh, there's a fire. There's a campfire. Let's see if I can like light this. No ignition. Uh, hang on. Craft. Log fire tool. If I got some bark and a wood stick, I could make a log fire tool. Uh, I would just need to make that. How do I make a wood stick out of wood? Okay. I would like to craft a wood stick, please. One wood stick. Thank you. I would also like to craft one. How do I make one bark? How pray tell? Hey, well, hang on a second here. I've got a wood stick here. And I also have a wood stick here. 
Well, now, let's not worry about such strange specifics, and let's instead worry about how we're going to make bark. I think we just make bark by peeling it off of a tree. Do I have a melee weapon? I have my crowbar. Uh, all right, let me just... Is that, tr Is that dropping anything? I'm breaking the tree. I don't think it's gonna give me any bark anytime soon, though. No, I'm getting wood sticks. We might get something out of this. Wood. It's just like Minecraft, dude! Hang on, I've, I've been here before, dude! We're not getting bark that way. We should move on. This place is gonna burn down any second now. I have a plan. We should travel. South. There's a small town to the south. We might be able to find some supplies. Let's get our fucking... Let's get our pistol loaded up and be careful. We have no idea what's on this island. We were not given the... Did you hear that? What the fuck is that thing? What is that? Oh, it's armored. Oh, there's a lot of them. There's actually a lot of them. They're still after me? They seem to still be after me. What is this? What are these weird rocks? This was a big mistake. Load up the shotgun. We need to get inside. It's raining something fierce. What is all this? There's like a giant fucking crater. Oh, what the hell are you? It's bad, 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 it's bad. The storm is bad, it's bad, we need to get inside. Maybe we shouldn't have gone down here. Where are we? Maybe we go to that dumpster. You need to fuck up! Oh, did that just almost ricochet at me? I'm getting out of here. I almost got shot by my own fucking bullet. Oh! The fuck away from me! Don't move. I want to see if I can get this fucking bear harvested for me. Fuck off. I want you on it. Get it. What is this? I just, I just want the bear. I just want the bear. I just want the bear. I just, can you just let me have the bear? I just need the, I just need, now what I'm gonna need everyone to do is give me a second so I can get the bear. You see, I'm going to eat the bear. God fucking damn it. Get out of here. All right. I just wanna harvest this bear. There's nothing on it. No slaughter. I don't have a weapon to slaughter this bear with. We're gonna need to keep moving for now. We have no means. We have no means to harvest the meat. Our best bet is to, you gotta be fucking kidding me with these zombies right now. Hang on, this place is fenced in. <laughs> it doesn't look good in there. What do we do, man? I need a moment of peace. Ooh, blueberries. Hell yeah, and cranberries, that's huge. Guys, maybe stuff's finally looking up for us. We might have a chance of getting out of here if we just don't get attacked by any creatures for a little bit. Look at this, we found the door into here. Maybe we can just use that. 
Maybe we live inside of this nice little, like, storage realm. It's open. We're fucking safe. Are there any creatures in here? Night. The environment will become dark and the temperature will drop. Press C to open the crafting panel. Use wood, cloth, and fat to make fire torches. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. I don't own that, but I do own a flashlight with a wide angle. God damn it. <sighs> Why did it say dismember? Wait a minute. Oh! Oh! Is that a gorilla? Okay, dude, let's just do a redo. That save was bad. Let's just do a full redo. Oops, I just loaded the same one again. Okay, we'll do this one. I have a plan. Once we get it. We are going to... <laughs> We're gonna help ourselves to all this stuff, but this time, okay, we're not gonna go south. <laughs> south is bad. We know this. We all know this. Disassemble. Here's what we are going to do. Shut up, little rat. I want to modify this weapon with a laser sight. There we go. So I can aim a little bit better. Good, because we own a laser sight. Gonna load up all the batteries into this thing. Get it equipped as well. And this time... Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. Hell yeah, man. Is this place different? No, it's the same. I just didn't ever walk over here. Okay, well, uh... Look. Let's... Harvest from some bushes, and let's try to figure out how we craft. Plant fiber, wood, wood sticks. Okay, that's good. Maybe we can make a little house for ourselves right next to this burning helicopter. No, we're not gonna go to the totally fucked up lab. That's like the worst thing we could do. Though it is convenient that it's close. Build. I would like to build. It's not expensive to build things, chat. It's really not. I'd like to make some stuff after I've harvested some more stuff. Like, I want to start crafting some things. Figure out where it is we're going to live. Pick a place. Where is the nearest... What the hell? Some of these symbols are very strange. I need a... We're going to need a car, among other things. Let's go on a little trip this away. Did you guys hear that? Did you all hear that? There was like a sloshing sound. Oh. I know there's a gorilla in this game now. Hang on. There's a rat down there. Did I not grab ammo? This is like an air rifle. It's made for- we can use it to kill rats to eat them. Without making a bunch of noise. I think I might have left the bullets in the- in the, uh... That guy. Here. Yeah, I did. Knocked and loaded. Hell yeah. PP pee dance is the cool new thing. True, dude! We love PP dance, dude! Okay. You hear that? Over yonder? Let's avoid going that way. There's something that way. I just want to take a look around. Integrated battery. Hey, that sounds pretty cool. We need those. 
There's some bodies. Warm cloth torso. No way they already saw me. Did they see? They know I'm here. Wait! No, they're just... They're just wandering. No, they have not seen me. Okay, those ones might have seen me. Well, I need to go in here. Wait, that one fucked off. It might just be this guy. But I think if I shoot my gun, they will all know. So let's try to be a little tactical about how we approach this. I'm gonna check out all the bodies on the ground. Because I'm looking for cloth. I want clothes. We need to stay warm. It's gonna get cold once the sun sets. We confirmed that last time before that gorilla ripped me in half. Oh fuck. Maybe, maybe I'm not that bad at melee. Chat, maybe the game... Maybe we equip a melee weapon and we see if maybe I can handle myself. Ha! Okay, I mean, it could have been worse and I got a replacement one when that one breaks. That's not bad. Z to dismember. I can't slaughter this guy, but I feel like I need to for some kind of zomboid or like CDDA reason. You know, what is that guy up to? Well, I'm gonna have to get rid of these two. We're not going anywhere until we clear these two. What do you want? Come on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you down just like I did your best friend here. Come on! Idiot! Yeah! Get the fuck out of here! They don't have anything on them. Someone's trying to open a door over there, do you hear that? But the cro the crowbar is working. Let's just try to fucking get in there and see if we can, like, get our bearings. Cloth head. Cloth head. I'm not really sure what the difference is between these, but this one seems like it's going to have more coverage for my head. It is. Canned fruit. That's big. Yeah, these bodies are good news. You can get a lot out of looting these. Money? Cash? <laughs> Guys, look at all the stuff we're getting. We're not gonna die. Casual shoes. Guys, we're getting so much loot from this place. How could we possibly be in any danger? Garbage. There is someone really trying to open a door. <laughs> was it this guy? I think it was this guy. Hey, idiot. You really, you, you really sure you wanna catch these hands? Ow! 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 My torso integrity is down! How do I heal? Bandage. Cloth. Dude, I didn't even know cloth was a- Ooh! Backpack full. Your backpack is full. Capacity of the backpack is limited. No more items can be picked up once the backpack is filled. You can sort your backpack or create a backpack with a larger capacity. Well, where's my current backpack? Cloth bag. Capacity 10. Now, I'm not sure why I expected that this would be a better backpack. Can I dismantle it? I want to disassemble it for cloth. There was a bow inside of the backpack. Yeah, I'm taking wood for that. <laughs> yeah, we're just ripping. I don't even need the bow parts, dude. I'm not gonna use a bow. I'm a I'm a gun man. I use guns. I don't want that. I like using guns. Yep. What a fucking real bad day this is. Anyways, I made it to the gun shop. 
Whoa, that's another small backpack. Anything in there? Damn! <laughs> we'll go loot that stuff after I'm done clearing out the gun shop. What? What? The gun shop has nothing in it but a mound of trash. We've been had. Go on there. Get. Oh! Don't get up. Fuck off. Hang on. Options. Nearby items off. I don't want to see those circles. It's taken me out of it. Cloth trousers. Can I disassemble this? Wait, I. What are my trousers? Warm cloth trousers. I can wear multiple layers of trousers. I'm putting on more pants. Yeah, anything on you? God, this storm is loud. <laughs> God, this storm is. Ooh! Another double barrel shotgun. Some batteries. Some salt, saltpeter. Some money. I mean, I, I think I'll disassemble this. And take all that. That'll help me repair this if it breaks at some point. Alright, I want to check that bag again over here. Cloth head. Imitation military uniform. Defense 10%. Wearing a lot of pants. We'll take this drum. We'll take the bottle. So we have something to drink out of. Alright. Where are we? I don't want to be here. This place sucks. And my guy is still... His torso integrity is bad. He, he lost a lot of integrity when he was clawed things in the backpack let's just get out of here let's go into the woods we're gonna try to build a nice little house for ourselves in the woods and then go from there we'll check out what's inside this building first maybe it'll be better than the last one did you hear that creatures in the distance we should stay focused I'm going in a wall. Right there's the door. Nothing. I just searched a TV. There's nothing in it. Nothing in this crate. This place is a ghost town, but perhaps we should just live here. You know, it's got everything we could want. It really does. We have a kitchen. We have an actual bed. I haven't seen any gorillas living here so far. There's been no gorillas. Outside the window, I mean, I see nothing of danger or threat to me. It's honestly, it's looking pretty good, this place. Aside from that guy down there to the south. But there's not much we can do about him. We should get out of here. No, I think we move north. I think we move north into the into the woods. And we try to make something for ourselves. Right past this stinky, nasty body. Yes. Yes, chat, these shrublands, these shall be my kingdom. We will live like this. Right next to Oh <gasps> Yo! If it wasn't for those creatures suddenly storming right towards me, this would be my new home. Maybe we just go inside. Maybe they won't notice me. Maybe we just slip right on inside. Okay. What the heck? <coughs> Fuck off! Oh, no. Oh, no, there's creatures. I 
have I made a big mistake? I've, I've navigated into some kind of apartment building. Hang on, lights on. I think I'm in a kitchen. Shut the fuck up, Rat Chan. I'm trying to get fucking food and water. A lot of canteens. Hell yeah, there's a lot of- I'm getting a lot of water. Yeah, I can't quite seem to get back- get to the back. Hang on, I'm just gonna pick up this and put it over there so I can try to squeeze into the back here. Move that too and just put it out of the way. Alright. Oh, hell yeah. Grab that. And the water. We need to find a place to live, Chad. Yeah, I am no longer joking around. But I don't think it can be here. This place is crawling with creatures. Maybe we just check and see. This looks like a medical cabinet. Oh, yes, I can use this to help the low durability on my chest. From the wounds I sustained earlier. Okay. Thanks for the guidance. You. Fricky. Alright. I don't need to eat that. That rat will sustain us for many a night. What have I done? Uh, we're just gonna close this. Alright. So I'm thinking, chat, we're gonna leave from this side. As soon as I find an exit, we're out of here. Front door works. <laughs> the sun set. We're out in the real dangerous part of town. Keep your shotgun loaded. Let's just live here. We're gonna build a little a little fire. Next to the glowing Is that glowing? It's fucking glowing. Radiant fruit. That's gotta be edible. Irra Does that say radiant or irradiant? Get on out of here! Go on! You're infected, not stupid. You know you can't win. Oh, Jesus! The bear! <laughs> yeah, you gonna make good food. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, my God. Fuck off! <laughs> Fucking made out of Kevlar, piece of shit. All right, we're gonna live here. Right on this bear. This bear marks my new home. Get excited, everyone. Right on this land right here will be my new home. All right. Build campfire. Right here. I don't have any rocks. I need to get some rocks. I see a rock. I'll break it with a crowbar, I guess. I don't really have any other choice. This is really depressing. <laughs> I have another crowbar, though. All right, we got some rocks. We have a lot of rocks now. Let's finish making this. And then I forgot I still need to find out how to get bark. Chat. <laughs> Where the fuck does bark come from? Because <laughs> I know it should be trees, but like when I hit the tree with the crowbar, it doesn't drop it. Also, huh? Need an axe for bark. Surely you can't mean, you can't mean that. But then I would need rope. <laughs> How do I make rope then? 
Oh. But then I would need plant fiber. Oh, no. It's bad, but we're gonna be fine. Once we make this fire, we are gonna be cooking. Let me just make some rope out of some plant fiber. Craft a bunch of it. Hell yeah, craft a couple. Why can't, why, and why pray tell, will you not allow me to bulk craft him? I'm thirsty. You're fine. Did the sun just come up? Dude, how long did it take to make a rope? <laughs> All right, well, uh, okay. Um, I'm gonna, apparently an hour. Take a small sip. No, take another small sip. I can see my meter down there. Take another small sip, another one. One more, big sip. One more big sip. One more small sip. One more small sip. Okay, the bottle's empty. I'm very tired now. You're fine. You need to finish building a house. Do you understand how bad this will be for you if you don't learn how to build a house? You need to finish making a stone axe now. Stone. In. Wood. In. Rope. In. I need more stones. I'll be right back. One minute, please. I just need one more. I'll just bring the rock over here. It's okay. Is this one big enough? Now this is gonna be the good one. Here we go. And here we go. Is that a bear? Yeah, a bear I took the life of. You see, I'm not as pathetic as some of you like to believe. I slayed that bear with these very hands and a double barrel shotgun to the face. Craft the stone axe. Equip the stone axe. Give me bark. It gave me some. Absolutely huge. Okay. You see, what I actually need more than that is a box. <laughs> now that I've thought about it, what I need more than anything right now is a storage box. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to place a box right here. And we're going to build that quick. Damn, man. Damn! We can put away a lot of stuff into this. Okay. Storage box is the cheap as hell. Good to know. Let's get rid of a lot of this crap for now. Hell yeah. Awesome. Move this over here. Let's make some basic tools and figure out how we get rid of these bodies. Oh wait, I can dismember them with the axe. There's gotta be a better one then. Hang on. The axe is cool and all, but can I make some kind of... I'm very tired. If my guy passes out before I'm able to, like, find a place to sleep, it's gonna be really bad. Let's try to butcher that bear. Holy crap, that's a lot of meat. Hang on, let me get this bush out of the way, and let's see if I can do something about this. Jeez! Well, we're not running out of... Fat and meat anytime soon. My inventory's actually full. <laughs> I thought those would stack. Well, that also got me the animal fur I need to, uh. Damn, there's a lot of stuff came out of that bear. Okay, the rat's gonna go bad soon. I need to cook this before I sleep. I'm gonna get rid of these bodies. Mainly because I'm afraid that they're going to get back up. 
Does that make sense? I'll have to make another axe after this, but I really am afraid they're going to get back up. What was that sound? Hello? I hear something over there. You all stay by the fire. You still in here? I I claim this land. It's my property now. You walked it on. Get on out of here. Only warning you pass on to that block, you're dead. Oh my god. Oh no, they brought their friends. Oh, mother of God. Take your friend and go! Oh, Jesus! Ah! Was that bad for me? Okay, they have spitters. We're gonna just get rid of that guy then. There's spitters. I'm gonna keep taking all the mutant tissue. A Molotov, some more cash. Dude, I, I, this is squalor. This is true squalor right now. I gotta get my shit together. What do we do? Uh, oh, oh, I like that. Uh, but it doesn't take nearby from this. That sucks. I thought it would... Oh wait, no, that's everything nearby on the ground. I thought it was showing me the nearby of what was also in my box nearby. Uh, but no, I was wrong. I'm stupid. <sighs> I'm fucking dumb. But it does make it easier for me to pick up all my garbage. The stuff I actually want from this. I'm guessing the other stuff will just despawn. Okay, let's get all this stuff put away. And then let's start making a fire. Let's just do a quick little... Log fire. We need bark and a wood stick. Wood stick? Check. Bark? Check. We should now be able to craft a log fire. Good. Add to craft and make it. Log fire tool. Can I just ignite it? It's that easy. Barbecue. Now let's cook up these rats. <laughs> Mm-mm-mm, now that's looking well cooked. Let's cook another. Yup. That's looking well cooked. Now that's a good meal. Yep. we'll eat another. Yep. Chad, I don't need to cook the bear, remember? I can eat raw meat. It says inedible for normal people. I am not a normal person. I forgot there's a skill tree. Wait, what? Wait. Huh? Red dose, blue dose, green dose. What, how do I know what uses a dose? Or how much of a dose I need? Unlock, build, workbench, unlock, craft. Okay, well, it seems like I need to make a workbench. So let's get, let's get all my fucking doses out of the box for a second and see what I can do with these. Lack of items. Wait, what? Hold up. Items are. I have to actually make a stone axe and hammer in order to unlock this skill. Okay. That makes sense. I need to actually make the things first. All right. Uh. Well, uh, yeah, I'll do that. Is this a one time use? No, it's got 10 uses. All right, so I've already got the axe. 
So I just need to get a, uh, I just need to make the hammer. Whoa. Just gotta make a hammer. We make a stone hammer, then we'll be cooking. Log, rock, rope. Do I have a rock in here? We have no more rocks. I have to break another fucking rock by hand. <laughs> Which one of these crowbars is the one that has no durability? This one's broken. I have to repair it with a grindstone. That one's not going anywhere. <sighs> what happens if I shoot a rock? Hell yeah, brother! That's how we do it out here in the wasteland! Hell yeah! That's how we do it! Log. Stick. Rock. Oh, sorry. Rope. Rope. I want to make a pickaxe and a hammer, to be honest. <laughs> to be frank, I'd love to do both. But, um, I think maybe I should make the pickaxe first. So that I don't have to fucking keep using bullets to quickly break rocks. Yeah, maybe we do that. Cool, cool, cool. Let's go break some rocks. What even is this? Iron ore. We're in a gold mine of iron. We have every material we could possibly need. We never need to worry about the outside again. Don't worry, Jet. We are going to be just fine out here. Shooting rocks is cooler. Yeah, I mean, it is. Where's that weird fruit I found? Item feature flashlight. <laughs> yeah, I've got my fancy glowing fruit in my hand. That'll work. If we ever need a flashlight and our batteries are out, we can just use the fruit we found, I guess. That's cool. All right, let's make the other thing. We need the hammer. I don't know what the good of the hammer is, but uh, we will make it. And I guess we'll also add another X. Yeah, do it. Nice. Okay. So now I should be able to learn this. Yes. And it didn't eat any of my doses. This one uses a dose. Okay, it says if it's using a dose. So I'm guessing these are all green dose. These are all blue dose. And these are all red dose. And technology is just, you have to craft the things. Okay. Yeah. All right. Build a workbench to unlock more items to craft. It's getting dark again. How we doing on fuel? That's too much. Give me that back. Fire's gotta stay lit. Although I'm going to be honest, the light for it's kind of flickery. The fire's really flickering around. Why is it doing that? Is that a bug? Hang on, let me see if I turn off post process. No. Let me see if I turn off all of the bloom of the game. No. All right, the fire's just a little flickery. It wasn't doing it like that before. I think fire is meant to flicker. Yeah, it's just a little, it just a little hurts my eyes a little. But I'm thinking that there might be something wrong, specifically because my flashlight's not working, even though the battery, how long have I left this bat? These batteries are out? Two. How the fuck did these batteries run out of power? Did I leave them on all night or some shit? 
This one still has charge. We'll just turn on now. Yeah, I mean, huh? I left them all on all night while I was crafting the rope. Oh no. Well, uh, look. Let's keep focusing on what's important. Uh, we want to make a workbench, and a and a cooking. We want to like cook, simple workbench. Okay, we want to make a simple old workbench. We have to use a stone hammer to do that. All right, we're gonna make a simple workbench right here. Easy, man. And my guy still hasn't slept, has he? <laughs> how, uh... How much longer do you all think he can last? Because I kind of forgot about it. I kind of forgot he needed to. Up until now. Hang on, I gotta go find a rock. Uh, I'm gonna grab this one by the spooky glowing fruit. No, guys, I don't want to sleep on the ground here. I just don't want to do that. He'll last another couple days, and by then I'll have made an actual bed for him, and he'll be way happier. We just need some time. I just need a little bit of fucking time. You need to trust me. Turn off the light and build now. Okay. What can I craft out of it? Okay. So this is the stuff I can- I can make iron now if I cooked iron. I can make grappling hooks, I can make arrows and all this other stuff. All right. Fascinating, fascinating. Not bad. I'm not sure why I'd want a grappling hook unless I was using that talent. This game definitely has a lot of focus on crafting. It's a lot- definitely took a lot of that probably from Cataclysm. Okay. So, I need to make a bed. I think that's the next thing I want to do pretty bad. We should try to make a bed. Which is in craft, not, uh... Portable sleeping bag, fur sleeping bag. How do I make cloth? It's just plant fiber. Guys, we can make a fucking sleeping bag right now and get some shut-eye. I'm very tired. It's okay. Calm down. You're gonna be- we're gonna get a nap in any second now. You just need to have a little bit of faith. Everything's gonna be fine, and then we're gonna go and explore. We're gonna go to that spooky lab in the distance, chat. It's not gonna be exciting. Sleeping outside, fully visible, really safe. But think about it like this. Think about it like this for a second. What has attacked me lately? It seems like the creatures of this world are starting to clock that perhaps they're not as safe as they once believed. Hello? How about you just stay on your side of the valley? The only thing I fear is the gorilla. All right, and until then, I don't fear much of anything at all. I don't think. What has killed me that I've run into? Nothing but the gorilla. Use your head. I've been conditioned to understand that that is the only danger that I face in this world. Now, excuse me. I need to make some cloth. God damn it. I'm gonna need a lot more of this. How much more do I need to make my sleeping bag? Two more, and then the animal fur, which I have. Incoming death. I'm going to go out on a limb and assume that on day one, the gorilla can't just be wandering the fucking city streets. Okay. Calm down. <laughs> there's no... There's no such thing as a gorilla. We're 
we're gonna build a bed right now he's coping it's not cope it's not cope hang on i got a quick save it's not cope besides look at my torso integrity it's better than it's ever been as time goes on we get stronger and stronger while the world around me remains weak and feeble No one is surprised. All right, we're gonna go grab that cloth and make a sleeping bag and get some shut eye before the sun rises. What was that sound? I heard the sound of something breaking, like loud and in the distance. Did you all hear that? Let's just make the bed. Go to sleep. All right. We made a sleeping bag. How do we use it? I'm going to deploy it right here. I dropped it on the ground. I'm going to deploy it right here. This doesn't look like I can just... Okay, there we go. Let's go to sleep until daytime. We're fine. See, nothing dared attack me. Nothing dared attack me. And now I've gotten a full night of sleep and I'm going to take a big sip of my water. Brand new day. All right, chat. Next on the docket, I want to spend all of my XP points on a skill tree. I don't want to do the grapple hook yet, but I do want to reduce the amount of... Huh. Melee attack damage? I think I kind of want to increase the amount of melee attack damage I do. Yeah, let's punch in some of those. Because sometimes I use melee attack. Lack of items, red dose one. But I... Oh, I need red dose two. I'm missing one red dose. Uh, let's reduce my stamina consumption as well. Okay. Then for firearms, we'll take... Uh... Um, faster reload seems really good, but so it is increasing my shotgun damage forever. I think I, I think that cast thing is like a vats mechanic, but I don't have like the, I don't have the stuff for that. Chad, stop talking to Katie. Can't you see you're freaking her out? Stop that now. Stop that. Yeah, I'm going to boost my reload speed for my shotguns. I'm going to create... Yeah, I think that's good. I think I'm going to boost it one more time so I instantly load my gun. Uh, for my shot. Okay. Max stamina. Stamina recovery. Sprint speed. It feels like the best one is... Whoa. Bullet time after I roll. <laughs> Wait, hold on a second. That's badass. Fuck all the other stuff. <laughs> yeah. As long as I keep rolling, I've now become Max Payne. Not bad. Not bad at all. Games change. We're way more powerful now than we were before. I keep on hearing stuff breaking in the distance, and I don't know where the sounds are coming from. I think there is a gorilla somewhere out there. I'm trying not to overthink it, but I'm starting to worry that perhaps I might be in genuine, absolute danger. I think something might be coming out of the woods soon to rip me in half. I'm trying to keep my spirits up, but frankly, my spirits are low, down low, down bad. Horrendous, perhaps. Perhaps if I build a wall. Could have just made a bed, dude. Could have just made a bed. You fucking idiot. God damn it. Could have just made a real bed. Fuck! 
Whatever. Fine, we'll make a, uh, we're, <laughs> we're gonna make, I want to wall this place in a little bit so I can sleep without, like, freaking out. Hang on, I'm gonna pick up all these rotten meats and move them away from the house. Okay, shift click just takes them all out and toss them on the ground. Perfect. Yeah, I think what we do right now is we get our axe out, we chop down these trees, we build ourselves a nice house. I'm starting to realize my character might be breaking trees really slow because he's, um, really bad at melee. You know, I'm starting to... Did my axe just break? How do I repair it? Rock three. Repair it. Good. Glad it's cheap. Did my guy just start punching that tree like Minecraft? Back to work. Yes. Okay, that tree's gone. Let's do this one too. Are there just bugs hanging out around my base? <laughs> my base? My obvious base? How dare they just- Look at those little creatures thinking they can just hang out near me. This is clearly my house. What the? Did I make a second X? Or did I dupe an X? Huh. I think I made it and I didn't realize I could repair the other one. Well. They're both broken, so uh, we're just gonna take whichever one is more broken and toss it out. Yep, we're just gonna toss this in the garbage. We'll equip this one, we'll go get some more rocks. Right now, and go from there. And then I think we'll go into the- z we'll go into the danger. So there is something- there's some fucking god damn it. Was that a, is that enough to repair the pickaxe? <laughs> okay, that's good. Ow! Oh! Freak! Why does everyone have fucking bulletproof armor? Get out of here! Go on now! He's just... I don't know if I can beat that one. I'm almost out of shotgun rounds and this stuff's gonna get real bad. He's leaving! Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you read the room. You knew you lost the second you entered. You scamper around back to your friends. You tell, you tell them not to come back here. Ever. I will fuck you up. I will, I will fuck you up. Oh my god, he ripped my head half off. Why does it sound like he actually did get his friends? Don't come back now! Don't! Back from once you came! Fuck off! Go on! Let that be the end of it. He grabs Boulder and takes it back to town. It's obviously safer to get this job done here. I do is the pickaxe broken? Or did I repair it? I did repair it, good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I should be charging my attacks, it breaks it faster. Town, he's delusional. There's nothing wrong with believing in yourself. That is, chat, there's nothing wrong with having like an exciting trajectory for your gameplay experience, okay? I'm sorry that I, I'm planning on having, like, an impressive township here. I'm sorry that's pissing you off so much. He's egotistical. K. 
can barely break this goddamn <laughs> fucking tree. It can't have just broke again. Huh. I'm starting to realize I'm using old garbage, like trashy, dumpy stone tools. Maybe I should look into that. But like my head has been wounded horribly by one zombie clawing at my face. Uh, maybe we take a look at the workbench. Hang on, skill tree. Well, I have to make a simple eighth and... I, wait, I just need 10 metal components. Okay. All right, well, uh, water well. How do I make that? Metal components. God, what? Please, how do I make iron plates? Help me, God! How do I make an iron pickaxe? I need to make one, just one little iron pickaxe. Just one little iron pickaxe. How do I get one? Help, I got brain damage from a guy clawing me on the head so fucking bad. You need to give me, you need to give me guidance. Ain't none of this safe furnace. Wait, hang on. <laughs> Hold up. Ten rocks! Game over. Game over. There's no fucking way. Ten? Dude, I'm lucky if I have five. Ever. I have two. And let me guess. Pickaxe is half broken. We have to venture out into the world to get more rocks. I have a plan, but no one's gonna like how it plays out. Hang on, I should eat some food. Most of the bear meat I have just sitting in the box in there is gonna go bad soon. I should eat it. Edible for another two days. Good shit. Eat it. We're allowed to eat meat raw. That's the rules. Keep eating. Did that meat hydrate me? For ten? Hell yeah. Eat all of it. Nice. All right, let's roll. Did that heal me at all? Does it make, make does it make my guy like feel good to eat raw bear meat? <laughs> Badass. I mean, I feel pretty good about it. If I didn't get like any like horrible. Hang on. Where are all the rocks? Help! Help, I don't, I don't really want no trouble. I'm just, I just need rocks. What the heck is going on down there? Oh, wait, this is that place I went to last time and I lost all those zombies inside of it. Now they're all pouring out to come get me. That's less than ideal. Where are all the rocks though? Oh, wait, I, I remember I shot that guy from over here. There must be rocks in this corner. Near him. Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. Now we grab this rock and we go back home. Yep. Now we, now we carry this rock back to base. Wait, why would I do that? Hang on. I'm starting to use my head for a second. I think it's dumb to carry this rock all the way back to base just so I can do what I'm doing here. Hang on. I'm starting to think about my actions before I do them. How many rocks is that? Eleven. It's time to cook. But wait. I'm gonna need more than that if I also want to repair this pickaxe. Huh. Wait a minute. I'm using my head again. This place has had a lot of, like, wreckage and stuff strewn about. I think there's a creature up here. But there's a lot of, like, blocks of things just, like, on the ground. Like, like, wood. I don't think all of it was, like, stuff... Like, my stray bullets hitting the trees. I'm starting to get worried about the gorilla. I just think the gorilla... The what? The gorilla. 
Yeah, I was hanging out at the scary, like, uh, like storage facility at night. And a giant gorilla came out of the darkness while I was in my inventory and broke my guy in half in one hit. And that's not me exaggerating. It really happened in one hit. <laughs> Why can't my guy run? What's the matter with him? You out of stamina? He's out of stamina. Well, let us begin our work. Where did I live? Wait, wait a minute. How the hell am I ever going to know where I live? I can't put a label down. Oh, I found it. Never mind. We're okay. I found town. Town's just fine. We got loads of iron. I just have to get rid of that guy. Dude, I swear to God I will shoot you to death. Stop screaming. Fuck off. Jesus! His feet have to be unarmored. He's just like, dude, what do I do about you? Are you cool? Don't come closer to me. I just, I just want to. Ruggie, stop it. Stop. I have three rounds left. I swear to God. He lived. This is way, this is a waste of my fucking ammo. I, what am I doing? I'm gonna have to peel him out of it. He's like, he's actually breaking my shit. All right, asshole. I'm gonna have to grab the crowbar and peel you out of it. Fine. Get the fuck out of here. Go on now. Well, that was really easy. Once I. Thanks. When a target is in a stun state and has a life value less than a certain value, the target can be executed with a dagger. Yo, this real water? Painkillers? Cloth? Money? Thanks, idiot. I don't really want to slaughter you. <laughs> I wish I had a roof. <laughs> How's my head doing? Integrity's at 55. We well, guys, it's gonna be okay. We're gonna be fine. We just need a little bit of time. We're gonna turn off the flashlight though, cause uh, that's we just don't. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make the furnace. We're just gonna build the furnace. How many rocks is that? 10? Epic. Right here. Right there. We'll just make it at, we'll make it right through the night. I bet this will produce light. Once it's on. Hey, what does a furnace use for fuel? Better Better work. Let me grab some iron. I broke some up here and didn't take it with me. No, that's salt. Well, this is iron. Better drop some. Okay, we have one iron ore. Cook. <laughs> Go on. Cook. Why aren't you cook why aren't you cooking? Oh! We are gonna live! We are going to live! How 
long is this gonna take, though? We have so much iron to collect while the fires roar. Fuck! Oh, my pickaxe fucking broke. My pickaxe broke. I don't have any ammo. I'm right. The bear meat's gonna go bad soon. I just have shells of ammo that I can't actually use. Most of my shit is broken. Ah. Uh, honestly, when I really think about my situation for more than 15 seconds, I think about crying. I really deeply consider just crying, sobbing. A little. But I'm gonna try to stay strong. We got some more iron ore. I'm gonna toss that in. Yo, we got the plates. All right, they cook pretty quick. Go on now. Get out in there. How much is it to actually make a pickaxe, like an iron one? An iron tube. And how, pray tell, how, pray tell, would I make an iron tube? Okay. Nice. That's pretty fucking cheap. We get one more, uh, we get one more iron plate, we can make a pickaxe like a good one. All right, guys. Uh, everyone get excited. We're gonna take a li we're gonna, we're gonna take a little nap. Okay, we're gonna take a little nap. Until daybreak. But first, I'm gonna save the game. It's gonna be fine. This isn't a bad idea. When the sun comes up, we're gonna be so... We're gonna be so healed. Hell yeah. Head's feeling good. The plates are cooked. Let's make... Some iron tools. First of all, we need to make some tubes. Huge. Put those back in. How... Okay, so it's two plates for each. So I'm going to make an axe. I'm going to make a pickaxe. The sounds those made didn't really give me much hope. <laughs> and my guy has head trauma. He's been like blurring out in the distance because of the head damage. But I am going to ditch these old tools. I have a spare iron tube to put into something else. Okay, so I guess now what I kind of want to do is go and mine some more iron. Oh, fuck. Who are you? Well, that was easy. Damn. Keep taking the shells just in case. Whoa! A full vehicle battery? There are cars in this game. I just haven't seen one. Alright. Well, to the north is all, like, ore. So let's start grabbing some of these and see what actually produces things. That's sulfur. I mean, no doubt we're gonna need sulfur. Like, these are all things I know I'm gonna need. So we might as well start grabbing some ores, right? I'm still hearing a horrible sound. Up north. That's a lot of salt. Sometimes when I go up here, I just hear this, this terrible sound of stuff breaking. How much does it cost to repair this? Just iron plates. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. We just want to get some, we're going to get ourselves some, uh, some resources before we try to go back into the, into the wasteland, I think. Oh. Word. No, 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 our house is going to be trash. It's going to be wood. It's going to be wood. I'm just grabbing these for, like, uh, for other stuff. Our house is going to be wood walls. 
you see. Matter of fact, I can build that part right now. Worry, worry not. <laughs> I'm about to finish the house. You just give me, you just give me one sec. I'm gonna make a door quick. Right here. Hang on, I should actually do the walls first. It don't matter. It, it don't matter. We're gonna make the door. Boom. Door. Done. Now we just fence that shit in and we got ourselves a house, you, dude, you know? It's pretty much that easy. This is not gonna align. There's actually this fucking fire in the way that's making it impossible for me to like do this right on top of it. Place that. Build it. I'm uh, struggling. My dude's having some trouble building it. Probably because I don't have any wood. That would, that would make it hard. Hang on. About time I get rid of this fucking tree. Oh yeah. We don't need any of that. That tree can fuck off. We never needed it. <laughs> this is our home. This is where we live. I'd like to destroy this. The fire. By hand, I guess. I don't really have a choice. Okay, that's just gonna be there. That has so much durability, I'll never get through it before it breaks my axe. Let's make the next thing. That's weird, because I tried to put a wall there, and when I placed it down, it blew up. We'll just try it again. Now that's starting to piss me off a little bit. Now I'm not exactly sure how to feel. I'm going to give this one more go, this time from a different angle. Okay. I'm only gonna tell you this one more time. You better let me put this here wall down. Or it's gonna get a little nasty in here, alright? Better be because of these shotgun and 19 millimeter shells. Better be. Cause I didn't spend all this time making my new homestead just to find out I couldn't finish it. Now get on down. That's what I thought. I am not playing around, but I am thirsty. That I am. Hey Chad, I just realized eventually I'm gonna run out of water. I don't know how to make a... I don't know how to make a clean water. Like, I guess I could kind of assume you do it with the fire, but, uh... Well, I didn't... I didn't really... I didn't really check. Because I see a thing that says cooking hob placed on bonfire where you make a... Oh, no. We might have to venture out into the wild today. After all, because I'm starting to realize I don't have the basics of survival. I do have a Molotov, though, and that's very cool. I think we can all agree. Like, that's really cool. We can do a lot with that. We are not doomed. Hang on, I want to cook more iron. Get on in there. Uh, how much wood do I still have sitting around? I mean, most of it's in the fucking furnace, even though I don't really need it all in there. Yeah. <laughs> Give me, uh, some of this back, actually. I don't think they needed all of that. I just want to finish the house. 
The small this house is gonna be too small. I'm gonna get immediately angry when I make it too small. Now what the hell's the problem here? Hold your horses one sec. What the? <laughs> Come on. Come on, dude. Well, it's a really cool wall, though. It's a really cool... But the thing we can all agree, Chad, at the end of the day, it's a really cool wall. Maybe we settle for fences. Maybe that's the play. I'm cool. I'm cool. It doesn't piss me off at all. I'm totally level-headed right now. Matter of fact, I'm feeling good. We're gonna go into town. I need to find some f supplies. But we ain't never getting anything. Alright. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna see if I can make some high explosive landmines. I'm gonna see if I can get a car. You know what? That's what I think I really wanna do. I think I need to see if I can get us a car. That might just be the only way we make it out of here alive. I could actually probably make a crossbow. That'd be cool too. Actually, wait, hang on. Wait a second. And I could make a leather bag. I actually have all the stuff for that as well. Hang on, maybe I just make that. Hell yeah. Maybe I'll just make a crossbow. What about the mansion? Uh, I left about 13,000 zombies in there, and since then they've just been agitated. It's fine, I saw this pistol. Alright, so chat, here's what I'm thinking. We go this way until we find that computer lab. I am going to go in there wildly unarmed but with the cast hang on i'm gonna eat all this food before it goes bad because it's gonna expire all this raw bear meat it's fine we got more ammo than we think we do chat check this one out We got a lot of ammo, 57 fucking rounds, Chad, 57 rounds! This stuff's fine. Let's go. Let's bring a crowbar. Let's go. Unlock the cool tech we need. Let's go do that. We got 57 rounds. Let's roll and get a gun. Maybe while we're out there too, a new one. And maybe, maybe we get a car. Going to die. Well, that's why I haven't gone to the mansion, just so you guys know. Why that hasn't been on the table. Since people keep asking. Huh, they don't know how to open doors. Hey, look, it's a bunch of deer and bears fighting a zombie. That's wild, nature's crazy. Chat. Nature's just crazy. Where you going? Your food, all right? I don't think they're gonna give me a chance to loot this. Oh, nope. Goodbye. I thought I was gonna loot that deer. I'm not. They got spitters again. We're gonna go. I'm trying to get to that lab. Maybe we'll get lucky. We could also find like a car or something. Uh, can I use this? It's like a water tank. Nothing.
That's gotta be the lab. Up ahead. Let's try to stay calm and quiet and get in without any noise. If we can help it. Is it locked? Oh, nope. Okay, I'm in. I thought that'd be harder. Hang on, that was easy. What the fuck was that? Was that my tummy? It says a boomer died on the on the log. Damn, well, I mean it didn't hit me. I never saw it. So as far as I'm concerned, it's not real. Okay, there went a second one. It was at the front door. I think I'm just gonna run inside and close the door. Easy. Alright, is there anything in here? This must be the computer. Enter system. Hardware debug. Repair cast system. Connect to cast system. Oh my freaking god! It's bad, I made a big mistake! Whoa! I'll be taking that. Seems like most of the zombies don't know I'm about to fucking kill them. Yes! Wait, I have to leave. Wait, wait a minute, I'm gonna have to go now. I just tossed a Molotov into the- Oh my fucking god! What is that? Get out of the- Get out of the house! They keep hitting me in my head! <laughs> Why are they always- They always hit me in my freaking head, dude! Get mom! Get mom! Ow! Ah! Hang on one second. Just gotta get out of here. Wait, of course, bullet time. Yeah, that'll do. There was an execute option for I I'm too tired. I killed myself. <laughs> killed myself! Ah! <laughs> Rolling takes a lot of energy. You can't just roll forever. How am I doing? Eh. Ow, stop spitting on me. I just want to go back home. I changed my mind. Fuck off. I just, I just got, I got this brain damage. I'm bleeding. I got, and the, for some reason, the, fuck you, dude. Come here. Fresh mint. It's okay, guys. They'll stop following us once we get back home, man. Once we get back, once we get back home, stuff is gonna get better, guys. We just have to get back home. Ow. Fucking why? This place is a lot more infested with zombies than I remember last time I came through. What the fuck was that? Don't worry about it. Oh. Oh. I think I might have lost them. Wait, no I didn't. But I think I'm getting close to losing them. Ah, 
I just got here is this Tarkov. Why do... Why that, I've seen that multiple times, and I don't know why it's what people keep going to. Do it this game. They see like an inventory system now, and they just assume it's Tarkov. Instantaneously. Boy, I'm lost. Oh no. Dude, I gotta fix this bleeding. I need to make a- I have to make a bandage. <laughs> Fuck! Frick! He's so dead. It's not looking good. It's really not looking good. What the hell's that? Why is it getting all like f weird? Where's my house? I forgot where my house is. Guys, I think a blowout's about to happen. <laughs> no, there's no such thing as blowouts. Those aren't real. We don't have to worry about blowouts. Oh, my house. We made it. What is that glowing thing? Hey, get out of here. Get away from these guys. These, those fucking birds were trying to eat my, my fucking dead corpses I have on my lawn. I'm going to sleep. I accidentally fucked up. All right. I'm going to sleep. Wake me up in the morning. I forgot to heal my bloody wound. I hope I don't wake up dead. I'm bleeding. How bad could it be? You're actually healing. <laughs> Dude, the thing is... You're actually getting better. Which is weird. Oh. The bleeding stopped. <laughs> I, I clenched and the bleeding closed. Yeah. No problem, man. Cool. Cool. So what the hell did I get? I got a bolt action fucking... Rifle with like a silencer or something. Do they have any rounds on it? No. Oh, yeah, that would have been really cool. Maybe I can go back there now and it won't be a shithole anymore. Maybe all the zombies burned to death. For sure. They're probably all dead. Yeah, yeah. I will say one thing though. This game has been just making me want to play Zero Sievert and I don't know why. I just want to play Zero Sievert really bad. Or Neo Scavenger. I did my time on Neo Scavenger. It might also just not help that I'm getting like a headache. I am getting a headache. Hope it feels better soon. I hope so too. Eventually this place will be safe. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing though. For a place that's supposed to only have like shotguns available for like hardware, like publicly, like according to lore, awful lot of fucking, I don't know, <laughs> guys with heavy Kevlar on, more than I fucking thought there would be for this. <laughs> Lots of guys walking around in bulletproof vests. 
We have to do some serious scavenging, or I need to start like teching up on iron as fast as I can for this game. Cause like I'm, I, I actually have gone through most of my bullets. I might have to make like a crossbow, but that won't help me against um, you know, all of the horrible bullshit. Yeah, I think we have to, dude. I think I gotta tech up as hard and fast as I can. Wood, nail, and iron hammer. I can I can instantly tech up to the next workbench right now. Immediately. I can just do it. Maybe we do. Yeah, maybe we do. I don't remember, did I make an iron hammer? It ate it when I learned the tech. So I can make another right now and just do that. I think we should. Craft it. Craft it. Make the item. Craft it. Yeah, we need to find a way to make more bullets. Because I just don't think I have the hardware to- I like the heart the towns seem really crowded in this game. So I kinda need some- I need an edge, you know? I need to get an edge. Uh, let's make some nails. And... Can I make the better bench now? 20 nails. We just need- we just need 20 wood. Okay. Uh, I've kind of given up on having a house. If that makes sense. Uh... I've kind of adopted this new design. Of just not really having walls. <laughs> Me too. Chad, come on. You're, you're gonna do just fine. Once the housing market crashes, it's your time. Once the housing market crashes and the entire economic structure of the country falls apart at the seams and we rise up, that's your time. Did, I, did the pickaxe just break the second I swung it? Chat, once society fully falls apart at the seams and we become some kind of roving nomadic society wandering the old destroyed civilization we once called home will be good to go don't you see you're just not you're just not seeing yet you're not using your eyes you gotta be fucking kidding me <laughs> Why, God? Sorry, does that say Cooper or? <laughs> huh. is powerful. <laughs> Golly, I feel like I'm about to get hit by lightning. Where's my door? <laughs> what happened? Was that always gone? <sighs> Damn you! Oh, wait. It was just bugged. Can I cook rats in the furnace? No. Ah, <sighs> then what good is it? Oh, I need fucking wood. God damn it. Time to cut down more trees. Takes a long time. Takes a real long time to chop down a tree. So you gotta be kidding me right now. You really gotta be kidding me. Repair this fucking thing. The music is truly tragic. I would argue this game might be some of the most pathetic POV I've done in a while. Because I can't even build the house. Why are you not swinging? Oh, he's tired. 
Tomato to tire. Tomato to tire. Finish it, dude. Finish the fight now. What do you mean you're short three? What do you fucking mean? You know what? I, I gotta know. Is this like bad? Is this like fucking sand or something? If I try to make a wall on this, is it just say it's not possible? Dude, why did I decide to live here? I could have put everything right on this patch of usable land. And now it's all off-center! What if I just stop building this and I move it? No, it's already mostly done. Wait, we just move it! Hang on, you guys are the bozos. You're the bozos, points at you, laughs. You're the bozos. You guys don't know anything about the game. Hold up. What the fuck, you didn't ask? I know. Because I knew you didn't know. I know. I still can't move this one. <laughs> but I can move the others. I'm guessing I just can't move that one because it's full. Maybe this means I can build a wall that works. I, I'm guessing because these things have stuff in them, they can't be moved. Cook faster. Oh yeah, I forgot, I got the cast system. CAS computer system experimental ballistic computer after equipped with CAS. It can analyze the target and provide aiming assistance. Equip. Oh, I have to get the prerequisite. Do I have it? Unlock skill. We have it. Ladies and gentlemen, we officially have the CAS aiming system. What does that do for me? Eighty percent increased damage on hit. Damn, dude! Imagine, imagine not owning the CAS aiming system. You know, imagine spending all of your bullets before having an eighty percent damage boost to your bullets forever. <laughs> Imagine not having anything at all to use now. Whatever, dude, I'm fine. Imagine not having a home. Because you built your house on top of fucking quicksand. <laughs> Head integrity, 50%. By the way. Guys, it, it's gonna be fine. We just unlocked the new crafting thing, and that means we can make metal components out of iron. It seems like everything just demands iron. Wait, are you telling me that there's not a better tier of tool? But I could make a katana. Okay. Yeah, but, um, how do I make bullet, though? Because I kind of need to learn how to make the bullet. I just need- it, I, it seems like I just need to craft a bunch of metal components out of the furnace now. Alright, I'll just make a bunch. Cause, um, we're gonna need these. Oh, you make a lot all at once. I did not need to do this many. Uh, we'll leave it at- we'll make like 40 total. Hey, give me those back. He's gonna be so mad when he finds out I'm 12, by the way. Are you fucking, like, dude, get that Kek W shit out of here, dude. What are you talking about? What happened? 
<laughs> what did you do? What's wrong with building those? None of you have played this game. I know there's not that many reviews for it. There's nothing, I didn't do anything wrong. Am I, did I kill myself by putting this on or something? Oh, I do, oh, it is Vax. Was that what we were talking about? Is that what's so funny? Uh, well, it don't, it don't matter. Um, uh, I got this, everyone. Look, all we need to do is make an ammo loader, which obviously is going to take 10 mil components and a grindstone. Yeah. And then I need to, you know, easy peasy. Making a grindstone's not hard. I've done it before. Hang on, what's this? Salt Peter, we have salt. Wait, no, we don't have salt Peter. Maybe we just focus on making crossbows. There's really not much stopping me from investing in a mechanical crossbow. I think that's like the best thing we could do. I think it is. Uh, what, how do I make mechanical components though? Ooh, cooking pot. We should make this. Wait, iron plates are not metal sheets, but metal sheets are made out of iron plates. Can I just leave these in there? I can. All right, we're just gonna leave all this crap, like crap in here for now. Wait a minute, has this bear meat expired? <laughs> oh, damn it. That was the last of my food, dude. At least I got this dead rat. Bottoms up, folks. I know you That's raw food. Don't you dare get sick. That's raw. That's what you like. What do you mean you What do you mean you're sick? You love raw food. Oh, ow, ow. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm actually going to die. Why is this happening to me? I didn't do anything wrong. A quick soda will save my life. For a second. Where's a can of food? Eat it! Eat it! Eat the food! Eat it! Where is it? Oh, he ate it. I lived. I lived. I'm freezing to death, but I lived. A lot of you probably thought that was the end of me. Huh. It's funny. But I lived. I'm gonna go ahead. Take a little nap. Why can't I eat this? Explain to me. Now. What's so wrong with it? I guess I could eat that. <laughs> I do need to heal. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I guess I'm just gonna sleep until daybreak and hope that when I wake up, everything's better. What was that? Hey, what? Is that my guy snoring? Okay. Hungry. My guy hungry. Well, man, here's the problem, man. We don't got no food, and we running out of water. We down to our last sippies. <laughs> We're gonna die. Get ready, chat. We're gonna die. All we have left is this funny pistol gun. Like this, like, air rifle. Wait a minute. 
168 damage. That's only half as much. Oh my god. I thought this gun was kind of like stupid, but it's actually kind of crazy. We have to go out and hunt for food. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. I want food. I need water. I need to be sustained or I'm going to die. Blah, 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 blah. Shut up. We need to harvest meat. We need a nice crisp piece of meat. We need it. It's the only way we make it out of here. Or berries. Berries would work. If we found berries... Hungry. Shut up. Blueberries? You like blueberries? Eat that! There you go, buddy. You happy? I'm thirsty. All right, we can find you some water. You just have to have some patience. We'll find you some. There's a deer. We're gonna have to take it down with vats. Move, move, move! Talon! Sorry about this one, idiot. But you're about to get... You're about to get bopped. The most important thing in this world right now is killing it. I'm putting five bullets. No, three bullets into its head. No! Okay, we got it. But I think I shot its ass off. I don't think I actually hit it in the head. So how does this thing charge? What's that? What's oh, another one? I'm fine with one. Let's not be greedy. Give me all that. A nice crisp piece of meat. Wait a minute, I should go kill that guy. He also counts as, as hydration. Get ready. We're gonna hunt you down, kill you too. There's a whole swarm of Whoa! Damn, I don't need fucking vats. Oh no. There's creatures that are gonna get in the way of me fucking killing this thing. Let's just do this quick. All of it. Grab all of it. Eat the meat. I'm not gonna die like this. I ain't gonna die because I ate one bad rat. All right. We are? No, we're not. Let's all get hyped because we're gonna live. I'm officially mandating now that our hype emote for this chat is pee pee dance. What the fuck is that? I'm out. When we want to say, let's go, we yell pee-pee dance. <laughs> Hell yeah. Let's go. We lived. I thought I was going to die, but we lived. We had to, we had to venture quite far, but we made it. Now, I do want to make the... I want to make this. I think the cooking hob is good. Though I might move the, um... I might move... What the fuck was that sound? Hey, get out of here! Go on! Why are you all... If you're gonna take them, just take them! Place just covered in birds. <laughs> Might move this. Did I just wait? Oh, that was confusing. I want to move this. I want to see if I empty it, if I can pick it up and move it. Oh my god. 
Remind me to drag it out. I, no, you can't even do it like that. Is that all of them? Good. You can't move the furnace. The furnace is where it is. We learned an important lesson about being careful of where you place stuff. You have a lot of shit that's just stuck. You get lost. Fucking rats. Okay, can I make the cooking pot? Craft one. Cool. I need to make some iron tubes. I think all of them turned into iron tubes. What's that sound? Oh, it's the sound it's the sound of the passage of time. Grab the pot. Grab the tubes. I'm gonna make a new fire in the middle here. That old one is just gonna be garbage. I'd like a new one, like, here. What are you, out of rocks? Of course- wait, what am I asking? Of course we fucking are. Why would we ever not be out of rocks? Oh wait, we have some here. What are you, out of wood? Why would I even ask? <laughs> Sucks to be a rocklet. Pee pee dance. Chat, can we also, uh, like establish right now that pee pee dance is a emote of positivity? So can we like not make pee pee dance like a toxic creature? I want PP Dance to be a force of good. <laughs> L take. <laughs> Fuck off. Come on, guys. I gave you a real urge emote and you're using it for evil. Just kind of cringe is all. How do I center this onto this? Is that right? Yeah, are we sure that's right? Well, I want to see if this works. Cook. Oh my god. We can make clean water now. We are not gonna die! We will live! Right, I'm gonna put that out. I might make another box over here and just, just, like, destroy the old box. Genuinely. How the fuck did these berries expire in my goddamn hands? It has been truly no time. What do you mean, expired? I mean, I think I might be the only real, like, PP dance enjoyer is the problem. And it's a damn shame. But, like, I'm gonna stand by. That emote's here to stay. Okay. Why? Okay, you literally, you literally got the fucking, like, furry run emote of you in my chat and you're gonna talk shit about pee pee dance you're gonna talk shit about pee pee dance <laughs> just let them dance loads of wood huge okay Violet. That felt like a l I picked up a lot more than 12, you know what I mean? Huh. Oh well. 
Actually, I'm going to take some because I want to make a chest up here. I'm just gonna skip walls. We're just never gonna do those, you know? I just think they're cringe. Though, looking at the size of storage boxes in this game, I can't imagine you ever needing that many. There's so much space. I'm gonna put this in the chest for now. It's weighing me down. But I'll probably make a couple. I do not want this one here. I want to move this one up. Actually, this one is half full. To be fair, this one's half full. Uh, let's move all the resources we use for building up. For now. Very good. Hang on to that. I think these are both broken. I need to make a grindstone. All right, uh, skill tree. We're not, we don't have nitric acid powder, or sulfuric acid, or any of that stuff. We just need 10 metal components to make like half this crap. Wait. Are you telling me? Okay, so we have the fastest furnace we can have for cooking. So I'm guessing we're going to need multiple because there is an upgrade, but it's not out yet. There is an upgraded furnace, but you don't, it's not in the game yet. So we're probably going to have to, you know, figure it out. Oh, we should make this. We should grab the metal components and make that. We should make a well. All right, that's objective one, make a well. Okay, how expensive is a well? How long have I been able to make a garbage grinder? You guys telling me I could have been making a garbage grinder? How long have I been able to make a location marker to know where my house is? What the heck? Hell yeah. Give me these. I'm guessing forever. <laughs> Damn right. Damn right. You can see that shit from space. PP dance. I peed my pants. Damn. <sighs> Listen, if I ever take off PP dance, it's going to be replaced with the pizza dance because, like, I, I miss that. I miss that little scamp. All right. But right now. Please replace it now. <laughs> Chat, there's nothing. The last. You guys are like, oh, get rid of PP dance. The last pissy boat actually had like piss in it. All right. This one's just a guy. And I don't think it's fair. He's just a guy dancing. Life isn't fair, Tomato. True, and it's exactly why PP Dance stays despite the public discourse surrounding it. You're right. Life isn't fair. My head integrity's almost back. All right, let's make that well. How expensive is this? Five stone pickaxes, dude! 50 rocks! Holy moly. This better sustain me for the rest of my days.
Yo, can you skip stone pickaxes and come back to it? Because <laughs> we have other parts we can put in right now. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. I want food. I'm hungry. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. I want food. I need. I need food. You eat meat for sustenance and hydration right now, dude. And you're going to be fucking pleased with that. All right, until we finish this well. And then we'll see. Okay, I... How's the pickaxe doing on durability? Not great. How many metal fucking sheets do I have? I have enough to keep repairing it. We're going on a nighttime iron run, chat. Get excited. Where's my poisonous uh, fruit that I use for light now? Because the... Yeah, the... F the flashlight's out of batteries. Okay, yeah. We're gonna unequip that. Move it over here. The only light source we use now is the funny radioactive fruit. Let's go. Now we're looking for rocks. We're looking for iron. That ain't iron. Radiant fruit just blew up and broke. What do you mean? It said it added to my inventory. I'm not seeing it there. So I'm guessing it's gone. Well, that's cool. I'm thirsty. Shut up. Shut your fucking mouth. And there's a guy. There's a couple guys. Activating rats mode. Botanic infected head. Okay, that's didn't really do the job. I'm worried about the gas of this thing. Because it's using, like, gas power, and eventually it's going to run out, and I think then I'm fucked with this one, too. Dude. Give me that wood and tree. We just need, I think we need like fucking 70 rocks. How many is that? 12. Okay. Canisters can be pumped. Yeah, but I don't know. Repair item, one pressure tank. Yeah, we need to make another pressure tank. I think I saw a thing for that. Pressure tank. We just have to make the lathe. Or the lathe. That's not too bad. Guys, it's gonna be fine. Unless the gorilla shows up. We all need to just get pray to God that uh the gorilla stays away. Remember the gorilla? Remember that weird spider thing we saw in the lab? There are horrible creatures out here, and we are just out here with them. They leave us alone, we leave them alone. That's the way I like it. That's Cooper Ore. I don't want that. Can these guys not attack me right now? Dude, fuck off. Thank you. I'm glad most of the enemies seem to leave you alone if you ask. I'm starting to think the gorilla is made up. There is no doubt video proof of it because I was streaming at the time. Okay. Sure. I barely had a chance to look at it, but it was real. And honestly, frankly, it's not very PP dance of you to doubt me like that live on my stream. Maybe you should have a little bit of faith. Oh! 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 Reloading. You need to fuck off! That's activate. Now you're fucked. 
You ever seen a guy hit a bear 18 times in the head with a fucking air rifle? Using cast power? Get out of here, you little rascal. All you is now is fresh meat. Yep. Let's bring all this here back. I'm thirsty. Well, dude, good news is we have a lot of meat now to eat to get you hydrated. Because that's how this game has taught me how to play. Yeah, we'll just hang on. What does that say? Expires in two days. We'll eat it. How much farther am I from my base? We need to continue on. I'm not returning yet. We still have more work to do. How much rock have I collected? I almost have enough. We're actually making pretty good time on the rocks. Get a couple more of these. A little more iron. My fucking pickaxe broke. Again. Horrid emoji. <sighs> Chat. You guys need to be more accepting of the people around you and the things around you. Right? Come on. Come on. I love this silly little dude. Hell yeah! Dastardly emoticon. Dude, lots of iron. How much iron? 19 plates at the end of this. That's not bad. I mean, it's nice. We live in an area with a lot of iron sitting around. That is good. I do, you know what I wish? I wish I could hover over blocks and see what's actually what, because I'm mixing up copper and iron. They are basically the same image to me. Copper's maybe a bit spikier, but like sometimes only. I mean, I know I'm gonna need the copper. It's just, I don't really like want, I don't want to use all my durability on this shit when I know I need other stuff more importantly. Yes, it does drop rocks. All right, that's 57. How many, I need to make also five fucking actual uh stone pickaxes so i need 65 rocks total there's some at the house did you hear that in the shadows i heard a sound we should return back to my property directly to the south come along we need to leave immediately post haste after I eat these yummy blueberries. Num num. Wasn't it iron pickaxes? Oddly enough, no. Stone. If it was iron, it would actually be easier to make for me at this point. But it's stone. So I have to go back to an old version and like break rocks again instead of just getting a bunch of iron in bulk, which would be way cheaper for- Like genuinely easier. The ghost well. Oh yeah, we have enough. All right, uh, wood sticks. We might need to make more rope though. But we have the fiber for that. Build, craft, we need to make more rope. Turns out the most time consuming thing you can craft in this game is ropes. <laughs> okay, we have a bunch of them now. We need to make five stone pickaxes. Oh, it's just wood. Yep. Hang on, I'll grab all those out in a minute. I want to eat all this food. Specifically for water. My guy's been very tired for about a thousand years. I don't think it actually, like, takes anything away from him. <laughs> Just 
gonna take a little bit, by the way. Is it a hundred degrees out? He's fine, my guy's fine. Don't listen to anything it says on his stat sheet. He's fine. He actually likes this weather. It might even be chilly. Sounds like he's dribbling a basketball. Yeah, what's up? Wait. Okay, yeah, okay. Hold on, I gotta dump a bunch of stuff. We're gonna leave a bunch of the food in here. Uh, I gotta cook a bunch of stuff at the furnace. Stop! Stop this! Go in. Good. You can't like shift click this stuff into here. It goes onto the ground, which keeps really pissing me off. Okay. Good. All right. Let's finish this. What the? You got low on wood. All right, I stumbled across some. The well is done, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get excited. Now we can fetch clean water however we so please. Dude, that's actually OP. Dude, this backpack can hold so much water. This guy's loaded up on water, dude. We're really, look at us, chat. Sure, this place covered in bugs, covered in dead bodies, no walls, no protection from the elements. My guy's tired, constantly about to pass out. But like, look at us. I think I'm gonna make that garbage grinder. How do I make scrap metal? Hey, wait a minute, how do I make scrap metal? I only know how to make mildly impressive hardware with the garbage grinder, but that doesn't make any sense. I would need the, the, well, huh? But that, that doesn't add up. I'm going to craft the lathe next. I'm just going to make all the, make all the tools. Five grindstones for this. Fine. Place it. You ever seen someone dribble like this? All right. We need more metal sheets. Sorry, more metal components. Good. Dude, there's no way that's not a fucking basketball. Right? There's no way that is a basketball dribbling. Right? There's no way it's not. Charcoal and copper plates to make grindstones. We have everything we need for that. Because this thing outputs charcoal. Okay, this thing needs to fuck off. The, uh, the sleeping bag can just be moved. Not as much charcoal as I thought it would output, though. Uh, when I look at it carefully. We have charcoal sitting around, right? Right? We, 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 we've worked so hard. We have three charcoal total. How we, uh... How we get that faster, though?
Oh. Oh, I just need a torch. <sighs> that means I gotta light this on fire again. Which means I have to go grab the fire thing from this thing again. And then I gotta light this on fire. So I can get a torch out of it. Wait a minute, that doesn't have anything to do with it. I'm stupid. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on a second. Nah, you just make a torch like this. Alright, you turn off again. Dude, I wish they had a Molotov. That'd make this all a lot easier. Uh, let's see. Uh, where the heck? They need a filter system. Like a way to like look up the... You know, the name or something. Because, uh... This isn't even in alphabetical order. <laughs> it's kind of just making it up as it goes. There's like a rarity system deciding what order these things are in. Wood, cloth, fat. I don't think I have enough cloth. You only have one. I'm gonna have to make more. Yeah. All right. Craft, cloth. It's not expensive. Yeah, we'll have to go get some. Vibes based system. about to seriously progress through this video game at, a, at an alarming rate in a couple of moments. Everyone should start bracing. Everyone start bracing because it's about to get epic. I need one more cloth. Game sucks. This game doesn't suck. What do you mean? All right, we can't come in here and say game sucks. You better have some. Res you better have some explanation. You better have like a valid, full-on essay on why this game sucks so bad, so I can have my opinion swayed. Because if not, I'm going to have to respond. I'm going to have to legally respond with Earth Stuffed. UI is the only bad part. UI is a little bad. So far, the houses I've gone into are a little lame. As in, like, the interiors are kind of empty. I wouldn't mind if the game let me zoom in more on my character. That's like an important thing, I think, to specifically me as a streamer. So it's not like, I like to be able to zoom in inches from my character's face, even when obviously the best way to play is like zoomed out. Uh, honestly, it's less the UI that's a problem for me and more that the key binds are bad. When I shift click to like move stuff into a box over here, it'll go onto the nearby items on the ground. Like, it, there's certain stuff that's not going to where I want it to go. And I think that's kind of freaking me out. Am I out of copper? Do I not have enough copper? My dude's very tired. Maybe we sleep and when we wake up in the morning, this will all be better. How you, how you feeling, man? You feeling better? Is there like a nasty smog coming out from over here? What is this? Chat. I am seeing a literal, I saw a literal smog coming out of this dead body. It was a spitter. Maybe I gotta cut up these bodies. I'm starting to realize these things might like be like, wait a minute. Do you remember that fucking mask? Oh no. How you, uh, how you feeling, man? Man? 
It doesn't say my guy's sick with the virus. But that's all the charcoal I needed. So, um, I guess he's fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's never been better. I'm gonna need to make more fucking copper. Which means I have to go mine more copper. In order to finish this. Alright, well, I've got the plates to repair my pickaxe. Let's go find some more copper at night. Problem is, I'm starting to get more nervous the more I do these trips out because, um, I hear scarier stuff every single time I go up here. And on top of it, I've not had any new bullets or ways to defend myself recently. So once I've run out of my stuff I have, I'm, I think I'm fucked. It's iron. We do need it. This is... What are you fighting, man? Please don't attack me while I'm reloading. All right, man, you just made me activate vats. Fine. Now you pissed me off. Get headshot. Get out of here. <gasps> Fuck yeah, dude. Soda. Is this copper? That's Cooper. Let's get a couple of these. Since I see a bunch in this patch. Dude. Equip the item. Cola und Fortnite Yippie PP dance. Yippee. Hell yeah. It is nice that I can pick up the rocks and move them next to other rocks and speed up the process of breaking them. That's pretty cool. I definitely just heard a bear. All right, well, we're getting out of here. We got what we needed. We got uh, 12 copper. We'll get that cooked up, something fierce. We're gonna leave now. You pee pee tent, stop! Stop, that's enough. You're having too much fun now. Now you're having too much fun. Dude, the well's insane. Stop going down there, man. Okay. I think I need to make another furnace. I think I gotta. Okay. Uh, what was I building? I wanted to build the chemical bench as well, which means I need even more mechanical components. It seems like I just need to bulk craft, like, another good amount of mechanical components, to be honest. Also, I think I'm done sleeping. Forever. I think, I, I think I'm quitting that. Oh, sorry, metal components. That would require nitric acid. Let's make the chemical bench as well and get that, like, outlined. Water bottles, what the hell? What a weird thing. 
Tin cans, water bottles, tool hammer. Yeah, I don't have most of that stuff. We're gonna leave that like it is. But well, we are pretty close to making that grindstone as soon as the copper's cooked. Which is going to take a little bit unless I have the uh, copper cut in line. Okay, it doesn't work like that. What was that scary sound? Was that a scary... What was that scary sound? I really need to get guns. No, you know what I fucking need to do while I'm waiting for this shit? Mechanical crossbow. No. Iron crossbow. Because I don't know how to make the mechanical part, but what I can do is make an iron crossbow. I just need some wood, some nails, which is easy, and some tendons. Let's make some nails. I think we have tendons in the box. Cool. Let's punch it in, and we'll make a crossbow. Then I can stop wasting all my resources. Craft it. Done. Now, wouldn't you just take a look at that bad boy? Take a look at this thing. Crossbow is a weapon that uses mechanical structure to store kinetic energy. It can shoot arrows. Holding down the reload key allows you to select different types of arrows. Cool. But as far as I'm concerned right now, we're running a little low on bullets, even for this one, and gas for it. So, uh, I don't know if I want to keep using it. So, uh, hang on a second. Give me this. I want to see if I can... No, no, no. No, no. Give me this. Can I modify... No, you can't modify the crossbow. Just curious. I was wondering if I could put the laser sight on it. It was worth a try, I guess. Tomato, I'm very tired now. What's wrong? What's got you so out of energy? What's wrong? How do I make arrows? I'm guessing it's the normal one. Metal arrow. Wood stick and iron arrowhead. Swear! How do I- But- 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 Okay, game. Where, pray tell, is scrap metal? Cause you've been telling me about it. I've been looking around. I can't find it anywhere. Because it seems like in order to make one, I'd need scrap metal, because I bet it comes out of the garbage grinder. Where's the trash? Why is my guy getting all hazy? Is it because he's sleepy? Chat, it better be because he's sleepy and not because he has the infection. I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna take a nap next to these rotting bodies. Let's, let's sleep. Till we're feeling better. About to wake up dead. I woke up alive. <laughs> Boy, you look a little foolish now. Anyways, let's try to find some metal to hit. With this here uh, pickaxe. Does this count? Drop scrap metal. That's iron wire. I don't need that. Drop scrap metal. That's a light bulb. I don't need it. Scrap metal. PP dance waking up a lot. Chad, it's just. It's just such a good emote, you know what I mean? Everyone can use it. What is that sound? Are the creatures approaching? Whatever, we got what we came for. That was really easy. 
you'll kill it in four months. Yeah, but like think of all the fun we're gonna have up until that moment, which is like up until tomorrow or something, you know? Think about it, use your head. I'm making the garbage grinder. Uh, right here. I don't have the wood to finish it. That really pisses me off that that just broke. Oh. Well, I found the wood to finish it. Why is there a fence in the middle of nowhere? That's where a house would have been if this wasn't quicksand. <laughs> if you could build things on this, that's where a house would have started. But unfortunately, this game t didn't teach me that. All right, game. Destroy this, uh... What do we have here that I can destroy? All right, game. Destroy this old rotten meat. Those ones are good. Expired. This one's expired. This one's expired. Oh, the garbage grinder really truly does just destroy and uh, destroy items. It doesn't have a per- it just spits out trash. Alright, so I need to get more scrap metal to make my arrows. Okay, well, where am I going to find more garbage? Oh. Oh, a car! That'll do. Is that a cap? Hell yeah! Okay, that helmet's way better, though. Okay, this is giving me mechanical components, which is pretty cool. Because I didn't know that was going to happen. Give me a bit of everything. Dude, this car is full of crap. What the heck? Tomato too tired. Dude, that's a lot of mechanical components actually. We needed that. What do we what do we need that for then? It was for a bench. Ah uh, yes. I don't fucking remember. No, it was for a tool. <laughs> it wasn't for a bench at all. I'm glad that this car will last forever and just keep spitting out iron and metal parts. I'm really glad it actually seems to be an infinite source of supplies. Goodbye. I shall return soon. Oh yeah, it was to make the better crossbow than the iron one. Boy, oh boy. I look like a fucking idiot right about now. Anyways, I am gonna make the better one and toss the old one in the garbage. Sorry, you little idiot. You got born at the wrong time. I don't need you anymore. I'm thirsty. Oh, yeah? We shall never want again for such trivial things. Make the last of these grindstones. 
and finish our bench. I'm <laughs> seeing some just miserable messages in the chat, guys. You guys are really pull pulling out your A game, dude. See, it's just like... It's just good. It's just really all just good. It's all, you know, it's all about spreading positivity. Yeah, it's good. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Wholesome and fun. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Wow. Uh, well, I'm I can tell you one thing I'm not going to fucking do is make fucking mechanical components out of iron plates when I can make them essentially for free out of uh, just a cart by hitting it a lot. That doesn't make any sense to me. Why would I need a Leatherman? Either. Okay, pressure tanks is nice and cheap. That's not bad. All right. I'd like to put in some of the stuff for this. This is worse than Grup's chat. Stop, guys. Don't, don't even bother trying to compare me to Grup. It's just not fair. Come on, fucking please. Expired, expired Prunella. Whatever you do, don't eat that. <laughs> that ain't just bad one time. It's gone full circle. I stuck my hand into my backpack to take a look at what was in there and it fucking bit me. That might mean it's good though. Huh. Hmm, it says HP 10. Double negative. No, I don't think I'm that stupid yet. I might get there soon, but I don't think I'm there yet. Yet. How do I make the arrows? In the darkness, I just want to make the arrows so I can know. Wood stick and iron arrowhead. So I need to make iron arrowheads. God, they really do make this a whole mess to figure out. Yeah, the UI for crafting sucks. I wouldn't mind that getting... I wouldn't mind a search thing. Because, like, even though, yeah, it was on the screen. It's like the fact that anything can be anywhere just makes me spend, like, half the time looking for it. Make some arrowhead. There also needs to be a bulk craft. Because you can't bulk craft. At all. Like, honestly, what every game should do is copy Cataclysm's crafting and call it a day. At least it's fast. At least Cataclysm's is nice and fast. Yeah, I don't get what the point of the queue is, if you have to click it all anyways. One at a time?! These arrows better change my life, motherfucker! How long has it been, my son? How long has it been? I haven't seen my family in so long. I just spend all day making metal arrows. I'm very tired now. Imagine you won't be able to use them with a crossbow because it requires bolts. Let's hope for your sake that that's not true.
Gamer time. Beep, 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 beep. Gamer time. Locked and loaded. Yo, <laughs> what the fuck? All right, let's roll. I want to go into town after I've drank and eaten some food. I want to see if I can get back to the lab. I need to ditch this expired prunella. <laughs> what? Why did I just toss it into my water supply? Get that out of the water. I'm going to throw it in the garbage. Get out. Now slurp this. Slurp this good. Hell yeah. Sippy. Hang on, do I? I should grab a bottle. I have my canteens. Hell yeah. Grab the canteen. Fill it with delicious spring water. Hell yeah. Delicious. Mmm. Hang on, is this edible? Oh hell, it still is. Not bad. We'll take the rest with us. We're going back up to the... We're going back west. Chat. We are going back west. Is this thing broken? It was. This one, I hate this one. Uh, what's that emote? Is that hot face? Yeah, that emote. I should have banned that emote, actually. That emote shouldn't be here anymore. I think it's worse than pee pee dance, actually. What about the, like, an evil imp emote? I feel bad for the creators of these emotes when they realized that the purpose of their emote was only so people could be down horrendous in texts all the time. I, I feel, I feel bad for them. You know, because I bet the person who made the hot face emote was like, oh, that's just like a, that'll be what someone uses when it's hot out. And they didn't think people were going to be like, using it to go like, I just, it's, uh, and just getting like, hang on. Kind of see how good this works. Damn! And I can just recollect the arrow. Well, we won the game. They're trying to open the door. <laughs> Ain't no way. Where are they? Are they crawling through the fucking walls? Fuck off! <laughs> I give my arrows back! Why did this have this happen to me? <laughs> Why are there two bears? I'm very tired now. They stopped. Take a look outside. I don't see him. Not today, motherfucker. Now you're fucked. I wish you luck in hell. You know I have vats. 
My vet's power is gone. I need to get those arrows. Is it at the door? Oh fuck, it's at the door. It's trying to break the door down. I didn't do anything wrong. You attacked me. You attacked me, dude. There's got to be a way out of this. Yes. Got to be. Bottle bomb. Are you done? Imagine if we had peace in our times. Wait, huge idea. Drop this in front of the door and then open the door like this. I can find a way to kind of plug the door with this. Ah! Oh! It worked! I came too far! Dude, I wanted to go to the lab! I can't, he's actually body blocking me, I can't leave. I can't leave. Cass is back. Now you're fucking dead. Oh. Ow. 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 Maybe we maybe we go in the morning. Maybe we go in the morning, cat. Maybe we maybe we leave go in the morning. I fucked up. My legs hurt. We're only gonna cut up that one. I don't care about the other one. Turns out there's a bear every 15 seconds in this fucking game. So why would I give a single shit about the other bear? Okay, why would I give it the arrows? Oh my god. Oh. Oh my body. My poor body. But that bear might have spiraled in any which way direction, dude. I saw him. Oh, he's here. Give me that. We lived. People didn't think it was possible, but we lived. There's 10 hours worth of ammo in that bear. Dude. I mean, I'm closer to the lab than I am home. I might as well push on. You know? My guy's very tired. We should go back and sleep. We have to. His legs got all chewed up by a giant bear. Oh, what the hell even is that thing? Hang on, I'm just gonna deal with this with my incredible aim. See you later. Wish I could tell you what happened, but I got him. This crossbow's cracked. Holy shit. Recipe for flashing bomb. Install a battery and a light emitting device on a regular tin can bomb. That's cool. Battery and five flashing bombs. Yeah, well, that'll protect. Did I just disassemble all of it? God damn it, this UI sucks. There's no way to equip it unless you actually click on it and press equip. And there's no confirmation on the fucking disassemble button. You gotta be kidding me. I've changed my tune. The UI is bad. 
I was gonna do such silly stuff with that. Get out of here! <laughs> Fuck off! Invincible rat. Dude, this place is a goddamn mess. I'm going to sleep. Don't wake me up until I'm feeling better. I'm glad nothing's ever attacked me at night. And never will. I awaken, fresh and rested. Big day today. All right, we are full of water. Is uh, some of this stuff going bad or has it always been bad? We're gonna dump some of it in the trash grinder and then we're moving on. How are my legs doing? They're feeling good enough to go. Expired, 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 good, expired. Everything else is good to go. We're gonna dump all this in the box and go. What if I just crafted the bombs again? <gasps> dude, that's not fair, dude. I didn't get that much stuff back. Uncool. 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 It's just not cool, dude. It's just kind of cringe is all. Whatever. Let's go. We have a long day today. We are going back to the lab to get what's ours. There's a lot of guns in there. I want them. Hopefully I didn't burn the place down. I might have. Do you think you're ever going to see the gorilla? The gorilla is down by there. You guys think I could take the gorilla? If I saw them, I bet I could f put five bullets right into their head, five arrows straight into their head, take them down. Like that. It's really far away though, I'd rather go to the lab. After the bears. Dude, I have cast though. I have cast, we'll quick save. Let's go. I have a, wait a minute, no, no, if I was gonna do that, I'd wanna, I'd want a crowbar that's repaired because I'd want, there's a bunch of stuff to open in there. Let me, let me quickly grab a crowbar and repair it. Or make lock picks, one or the other. If I just make a Leatherman, I can get like, basically infinite lockpicks. Which means I need a screw uh, screwdriver, which is, well, somewhere. Or not. Oh. Iron plate and wood. Okay, we're just gonna make infinite lockpicks, because apparently that's really cheap. Like, this is a staggeringly cheap recipe. Okay, that makes two screwdrivers for some reason. Uh, and now we'll just make, let's grab some mechanical parts from the box. I'll just make two. I don't know if these things have a durability. Yeah, they do. Okay, and then if I grab a bunch of copper wires or iron wires, we can just make a ton of lockpicks when we need them. Do these stack? 
No. That's looking good for now. Let's go. If we want more, we can make them. I'm gonna save. Let's go down and see the gorilla. <laughs> it's probably gone. Chad, it's probably gone. Horrible. Damn. I mean, the crossbow slaps. Stop looking at me. Really, like, if you buckled down and did it as fast as you could, you could get this as, like, your main weapon in, like, actually 20 minutes. Realistically, like, if I knew what I'd been doing from the very start, I could have easily gotten this. Like, immediately. Seems like that, I mean, this is, this is early access, obviously. I think there needs to be some balance around progression in a way that doesn't make it grindy but incentivizes me to actually want to explore because um, I don't really need to. I, it feels like there's no gear I'm going to find in town that's better than what I can make on my own so far. Well, we're getting close to Gorilla. I tried to speed run for crossbows about 120 seconds. Dude, that's fucking hype, man. Now that... <laughs> now that's pee-pee dance. Hello. Oh. Gotcha. The fact that you can pick up the arrows again is crazy. How do I beat this guy, though? Yeah, that's going to be more complicated. Everything else is a piece of cake. That dude's got, like, metal for his face. I think I'm just going to go around him. I think that's how I beat him, is I don't engage at all. All right, guys. I'm going to quick save. This is the gorilla's place. We're going to go in there. Well, we're going to have a word with the guy. Remember me? Yeah, you killed me. Yeah, well, now I've got the advanced cast targeting system. Once I've killed all your friends... Hey, stop that. I'm not fighting you if you're gonna, like, turn into plants. Once I've killed all your friends that get in my way, I'm gonna kill you. Man, this place is big. I, I forgot I was running through here at night last time, so I didn't really get a good look at the place. All right, gorilla. Where are you at? Come out. Doors open. That's not my guy. Where is he? I'm ready with Vec the second I see him. Oh, Jesus. Get out of here. You're not my guy. I don't know you. Oh, I see him. He's chasing a deer. After him now. Come on. Come on now! He's after that deer! Get him! Hey! Hey, you! Yeah, now you're fucked. Let's see how you handle ten crossbow bolts to the fucking head. Oh my fucking god! Shut him! Three, he's still alive. Four, still going. Five, still. There's 
got broken in half. Chat. Good end bit. Stop! Stop that! No! Nah, no! We are, there's more stream to do! There's more stream! Guys, don't say that! That's not- I'm not predictable! I'm not predictable! Guys, I'm, I'm not predictable! Alright, I'm not that predictable! <laughs>